Hello, every oh my goodness, the timing. Boo. Boo! Oh no, I'm so scared. <laughs> Hello everybody, welcome! That was that was actually impeccable timing. Nice. <laughs> Hello everybody, welcome! Welcome back to Inscription. I am so so excited to play more of this. I I've all week I've just been going, I wanna play Inscription. I I wanna play it. <laughs> So I'm really excited it's Sunday again and I can play it again because there's still so much to do and I still don't have a clue what's going on and it's wonderful and marvelous. But uh, welcome everybody! Lumsev, congratulations on the first! Welcome, welcome! Nice to see you! Vio Gatito, hello! Welcome into the stream! I hope you're doing well! Welcome on in! Grace, no, hello! Lovely to see you! Hi, hi! Hello, water! Hey, yo! <laughs> Lovely to see you. Thank you for the, the pops. The... Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Brie, hello. Sunken Shell, hello. Has Kitty, hello. Welcome on in. Sizume, hello. Welcome. Thank you so much for joining me today. And welcome, welcome. And thank you so much for the, the resub for 38 months as well, Lumsev. I can't believe it's been 38 months. It's so wild. Thank you so much. <laughs> I really appreciate it. It's always nice knowing that people keep coming back. Like, uh, I, I must be doing something right. <laughs> but uh, welcome on in. I hope everyone's had a good weekend. I hope people have had a, a lovely, lovely weekend with whatever you decided to do. I, um, I slept. I slept a lot <laughs> this weekend. <laughs> I didn't get any of the stuff done that I planned to do, but I did sleep, so I consider that a victory overall. Like, I, <laughs> like I, it, I do still have a lot of stuff that I'm going to have to do whenever I find a chance during the week that I probably should have done this weekend, but I'm... I would rather have the sleep at the moment, honestly. I'm If I'm getting sleep, I'm, I'm keeping it. I'm having that sleep. I'm grabbing it with both hands. <laughs> Even when it's at completely the wrong times, but it's it's okay. It's all right. <laughs> not complaining. Good good to hear it. I'm glad. Even if it's like uh, not, it could be better. So long as it's not worse, that is all right. But yeah, the sleep is important too. It is. It's it's the kind of situation where I probably would have like pushed myself to get all of my work done and then been super tired. But I decided um, I should probably have the sleep instead. Especially so that I can have energy for when I play Inscription. <laughs> Honestly, the whole motivation today was just like, I could get some work done. Or I could rest up to make sure I'm awake for video games. And I I feel like the video games are the important part there. Like, that's, that's the priority. Like, <laughs> work or Inscription, it's easy. Easy, not a problem. But yes, last time I played this, um, I think I did pretty well. I don't know how most people end up doing things. Um, I feel very proud of the fact that I've only died once, but I have a little feeling that the game might want me to die more. So I might end up like gating myself out of stuff unless I die more. But I'm also a really stubborn person and I don't want to die. So... <laughs> So it may end up taking me longer than it needs to because I simply do not want to die. And I want to keep like fighting and trying my best even when it seems hopeless. So uh, we'll see how it goes. We'll see how it goes. But I have a few ideas on what I might need to do. I mean, obviously the first thing is just continue along the path. I've, I've beaten two bosses. I don't know how many bosses there are. There could be like endless bosses. It could just be an endless path that I can never get off. But there could be an end too, which is why I'm like, I don't want to die in case I don't actually have to. And then I will just feel disappointed in myself. <laughs> but another thing I really want to do as well is since last time, um, I, I got that like the, the wolf in a cage. And I had the thought of like, oh, I wonder like if this gets attacked in battle, maybe it'll attack the cage and the wolf will be free. <laughs> Get good. <laughs> but uh, that's uh, that's my current theory. And I did actually have it out in battle, but I put it in a spot where it was only taking like one damage every turn. So it didn't actually 
get destroyed. So that is like my biggest thing I want to try at the moment. <laughs> like it might literally do nothing, but I feel like this is the kind of game that would reward thinking like that. I feel like if I do break that cage, then I'll be like, it, it will break the cage. Oh, wait. Oh my God. Wait. I've, oh, I've had a thought. I've just had a thought. I've just had a thought. I've had a thought. I've had a thought. I've had an idea. I've had a a thought in my brain. I will hold on. I'll leave it there a second. There's more people too. Hi Tay. Lovely to see you. Hope the game has been mind boggling. Oh, it's incredible. It really has been. It's so good. Oh, there could be eight. There could be eight. That would be a good number of bosses to have. And GG, hello! I'm glad you like the title. I, I thought very, very hard about it and then just put nothing. <laughs> but welcome, welcome! But, uh, okay, yes, I, I saw this last time. You considered one of the angler's catches as a meal, but the rank odor deterred you. Dinner would have to wait. And then we move on to... Let me think. This... A frigid gust of wind billowed, unwelcome, into your lungs. The beauty of the falling snow failed to distract you from the chill in your bones. You had ascended to the snow line. Ooh. So we've had the first area, which I've already forgotten what it was. We've had the wetlands. And now we've got the snow line. But um, I just had a sudden thought. There's a wolf in a cage right here. What if... What if this card has something to do with this wolf? Oh, do I... Oh, yeah, let me take that. There we go. I need to just keep coming back and checking that skull, don't I? I sure did something with that, too. I want to know how to get this. I want to get this knife. I want to get this knife. I don't know why the squirrel has a knife. Maybe, maybe I have to sacrifice more squirrels. <laughs> maybe that's the opposite of what I need to do. Also, Tim, hello. Welcome, welcome. Red Sunday cat. Wait, I guess I am red now. I'm, I'm, I'm not the, the pink cat today. I'm, I'm the red cat. <laughs> but welcome, welcome. Yes, I want to become the knife cat. Anyway, uh, what, what is this? I don't know if I recognize this icon. Oh no, wait, is that like the... Hold on. I'm gonna refresh my memory by going this way. I may regret it. Oh, the, the, the cave. I see, yes. The trial of wisdom, the three drawn cards must have at least three sigils to pass. The trial of blood, they must cost at least four blood combined to pass. Or the trial of bones, they must cost at least five bones combined to surpass. Okay. So, not gonna be the bones one. That is very risky. Honestly, I think the sigils one is my best bet, because I only have, like, two that don't have a sigil. So, hopefully, luck will be on my side. And I won't draw the rattler or the workaround. And, like, maybe I'll draw one of the ones that's got, like, like, like the me with two sigils if i draw that one that's that's two out of three immediately with one card so i'm gonna go for the sigil one and hope let the trial of wisdom begin one two no are you kidding me are you kidding me all of the chances that was like the lowest chance out of all of them that was oh i mm. Ouch. Well, I guess I, I'm not wise today. <laughs> you know what it is? Hold on, hold on. Uh, could somebody redeem a hydrate, please? Pretty please. I could do it myself, but I don't want to tap out of the game window. Because <laughs> whenever I'm in the game for this, I, I can't move my mouse like out of the, the game the game screen without having to like alt tab and I simply cannot be bothered with that but thank you Lumsev for the hydrate yeah I got it thank you for the hydrate I need monster I 
I shouldn't have gone into a trial of wisdom before having any monster. That's That was my mistake. <laughs> Thank you for the hydrate. Thank you for the sad violins. See, the, the trial of bones would have passed. I know, but I... Like, I literally could only have passed the trial of bones if I drew, like, the rattler or the coyote and the other one. Which is such a low chance. Which is why I didn't choose that one. And of course, those are the ones that ends up being picked. Like... It, the worst luck. The worst luck. But I am i still feel like that was probably my uh, the best decision I could have made there. It was unfortunate. But it's okay. I don't know what happens when I lose here. Failure. The creature whispered as it is faded into the blackness. Well, that's ominous. <laughs> um, okay, I guess. We'll get items. Ooh, oh, it's a little piggy bank. It's a little piggy bank with bones. Some bone tokens for a rainy night. Or, oh, what did the hourglass do again? Oh, yeah, oh, that, oh. I actually really want this. For whenever I reach the next boss. I want that. That piss pitiful opossum? Wait, there's a frozen opossum here? Huh? Oh. Zero power, five health, frozen away. I wonder, oh. I wonder if this might actually be something that could be relevant and useful in the icy areas of the snow line. Ooh. Although I do like the idea of the bonus bones immediately. Oh, but then another, like, just skip a turn. I'm, I'm just gonna, <laughs> I'm just gonna hold, hold these. Okay, what did that do again? Oh yeah, attack as though they have the airborne sigil. That could be useful if I get a hard hitter out and I'm like about to die and I can just like thwack directly. Could be useful, but I think I'm gonna go... You know what? I think the smart choice would be the black goat. I'm gonna go for the frozen opossum because I'm curious. I'm curious as to what the heck it will do. Ooh, oh, okay. So this is going to be like normal encounter or souped up encounter. Right, what is it, what is it like on each path? I ooh. Yeah, cuz this is just like two minor encounters and card stuff, and then this is like the two bigger encounters, but there's another cave opportunity and also the the terrifying campsite with the um the people who probably maybe won't eat us oh how how risky am i feeling i have two hourglasses i'm tempted to yeah why not why not life is for taking risks oh okay yep you have a oh it's got reflective damage oh so whenever Whenever I hit a card with that sigil, my card will take damage. That's a little bit of a pain. Oh, there's an egg. Raven egg. Oh. And then there, there's the, the elk fawn. Which is a fledgling and will grow more powerful. That The, the raven will also grow. Ooh, I don't like this. Ooh. Well, I do have myself, at least. I feel like this is so broken. <laughs> this card is like, it feels bad that I have this as a card. I'm just waiting for the inevitable point where like my own card will be like turned against me or something. I'll just end up like regretting all of my decisions. Who knows, maybe that won't happen. Maybe I'm just paranoid. But I think what I'm gonna do is I'm going to put myself here so I can deal with the elk when that moves along. Because it's going to move like down and to the right, but there's nowhere to go to the right, so I think it just moves to here. So I got a squirrel, and I'm going to use the squirrel to get me in here. Oh wait, and I'll, I'll get an item because I've got myself. So what if I get this frozen opossum and I can figure out what this does? does it do? It has five health, and it is frozen. 
I don't know what I want to even do with it. Because <laughs> I do have my lovely stoat as oh. well. A stoat might be good for dealing with the raven. Because the raven's going to do the airborne attacks. Maybe my lovely stoat can take the raven out. Maybe I do that. Awesome, Lyra! Hello! Welcome, welcome! Oh my goodness, 45 months! The tier 3 sub! Thank you so much! Thank you so much! Welcome! How's it going? Happy Sunday! I love the way the text-to-speech just did the most, like, uninterested... Oh, when you typed it in caps lock. <laughs> but uh, welcome, welcome! Thank you so much! Welcome back to Inscription. Um, I, I may have been making silly decisions. But I think it's gonna be okay. Okay, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna get this frozen opossum. Okay, if I stick it here, the raven's not actually gonna attack it. Hmm. Hmm. When a card bearing this sigil perishes, the creature inside is released in its place. So this doesn't become an opossum until it's been hit for five damage. So that's actually like a really good tanky card that I probably should have put where I put Leary. <laughs> so I'll hold on to that. I'll hold on to this. I'm not I'm not sure about whether to put the stoat or not. I'm worried about my stoat getting hurt and dying, and then he'll get mad at me again because it keeps happening. Oh, but I don't have anything to sacrifice anyway at the moment. So I can't even do that. Yeah, we'll leave it at that. I'll just start with a, a solid four damage immediately. That seems pretty good to me. Oh, wait. Oh. I wonder if... Oh, I don't think it'll let me sacrifice the frozen opossum as, like, a creature for blood because like all the creatures have like the little paw in the bottom and this one has like the item one. Ah, uh, if I could just get like one more damage, I'd just win in one turn. <laughs> but this is okay, this is a good start. Start like that. Hello, hello. I'm mad now. Okay, I get a squirrel. And I'm gonna kill this whole line. I think I'm going to take two damage from it, but I will just, like, take out this whole line. Because the damage continues through. I do five damage, and this has one health, this has four health. I think I just kill both of these. Straight down like that. And then I can get my stoat to, like, just at least hit the raven egg, I think. I think that's what I'm doing here. Boop. Okay. <laughs> Stop being disappointed in every decision I make. I like to see you do better. You're stuck in a card, weird sentient stoat. No. <laughs> anyway. Yeah, I think that's good. Yep, took them both out. All right, it's a raven now. Oh, that did hurt a bit. Oh, that did hurt a bit, but it doesn't matter because I'm literally just going to win now, I think. It doesn't matter what I do. Like, I'm just going to hit for five damage. Oh, I'm going to get... <gasps> I'm gonna get so many teeth from this. Nice. <laughs> yeah, I think I just win. Just like that. Yep. Yeah. Oh, oh, I've got so, <laughs> I've got so many teeth. <laughs> oh, that is nice. Nice. Okay, hold on. I want to check something. Okay, no. I was wondering if, like, after battles, I might get more teeth in the skull, but. Maybe not. <laughs> Stuck in a card, meanwhile the Lyric card is right next to it. Okay, but that's like um, my, my past self, not my current self. <laughs> I realize it's, it's a bit hypocritical actually, isn't it? But, oh, you had French toast as well, Lyra. Oh, nice. I just had a, a full chicken roast dinner before the stream, so that was really nice. It's so funny because recently, uh, me and the family, we were trying to find a new show to watch because we finished watching a lot of the shows that we were watching together. And so we decided to start watching Sweet Pea, which is a show that came out... It's, it's only just come out. It's, it's a British series about 
a woman who um, snaps and becomes a, a killer. <laughs> Something like really nice and jolly. Like lovely, lovely dinner time entertainment. <laughs> but it's really good. We're only a couple episodes in so far, but I'm like, I feel kind of bad. I'm just here rooting for the serial killer. I'm, I'm just like, yeah, you get them. You, you get them. They, yeah. <laughs> it's very good though. It's a very good show. But yeah, I've had a, I've had a very relaxing Sunday. It's been very nice. Anyway, let's, let's hope this cave will go a bit better than last time. Hi. What is that? That's the trial of power. It needs to have at least four attack to, to pass. That's the sigil one again. And the trial of bones. Ugh. Oh, one of my teeth fell out of the the cup. It, my my cup it doth spill over. I still feel like the sigil one's my best bet. Like the only way I can win the bones one is if I draw the rattler or if I draw the coyote and one of these others. That's the only way I can win that one. Whereas the sigil one, I win so long as I don't pull an ant or a rattler. <laughs> like, I'm gonna try it again. It's, 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 it didn't work once. It's gotta work this time, right? What, what are the damage? Yeah, the damage they do is all like really low too. I don't, I don't like my chances of getting four off in like three cards. Yeah, that would be fairly tricky. I'm going sigils, again. You better, you better draw the sigil cards this time. Let the trial of wisdom begin. Yes! Oh, I won. Yeah. There we go. That's more like it. Four out of three. You have passed. There. That makes up for last time. Yeah! <laughs> oh my goodness, I had like combined cheer confetti hydrate. That was beautiful timing. <laughs> it looked like the can was like part of like the confetti that was being thrown at me. Like someone just left a can in the middle of it. <laughs> But thank you, thank you for the hydrate too. Celebratory sippy. Let's see what we got. A beaver. Um. Oh, a beaver makes dams next to it. That could be useful. And also, when it dies, it gives four bones, but it costs two. A uh, kingfisher. Whoa! This. Was <laughs> Whoa! Whoa! This is the one that was really annoying last time. Wait, no, having... Oh. No, that's actually rubbish. <laughs> that's actually so bad. This kingfisher would have been incredible. But it's got burrower, so basically just like whenever there's an empty space, the kingfisher will pop up from its invincible position and just die because it's only got one health. That's really bad. I'm not picking that one. <laughs> And then, oh, Rattler with a sigil. Oh. Oh, that could be a nice little sacrificing thing. Oh. Oh, I'm going for the Rattler, actually. Okay. <laughs> All right, campfire time. The warm light of a campfire was a welcome sight. Though the ten hungry eyes around it dampened the greeting. Warm a creature by the fire, enhance its health, said one. Oh, wait, plus two health. That's good. That's really good. That's really good. I, I want to. <laughs> Stoat really doesn't want me to. <laughs> um... Which of these do I want to have more health that I also would not mind potentially dying because I don't trust these people? Hmm. Oh, wait, my wolf. I've been buffing my wolf a bunch because now it's got like the, the prong attack. It can attack two, two directions, but it's only got two health. I think if I can buff the wolf, that feels like it would be very worth it. 
I'm gonna do that and I'm just gonna hope my wolf doesn't die. Yeah, look at that. The survivors were right about the flames. They had enhanced the creature's health. Spotting a few of the survivors drooling, you made a hasty retreat with your wolf. Okay, I'm fine again. I'm, I really don't trust these campfires. I'm like, I'm just waiting for something awful to happen. <laughs> All right, time for another... I, I guess, like, when it's this one, it's the, the totem bites. Like, this is a regular encounter. This is an encounter with the, the totem that adds the sigils. Yep. And again, it's... If I hit a moose, they'll hit me back. Oh, greetings! Hi! Nice to see you. See, I really like the stink bug. The stink bug is lovely and friendly and sweet, and then the stoat is just, like, berating me at every turn. Like, I'm <laughs> like I still... I still think I trust the stoat. Like, the stoat seems to have a plan, albeit a vague one, that I don't have much about. I, I feel like the plan is to find the card with the plan, <laughs> which is... Um, it's it's a bit of a, a flimsy plan, but it's it's better than nothing. But the stink bug is just really sweet. They're just a, a lovely little bug. A, a lovely smelly bug. Right. Well, I have to I have to do something to start with. Right, what do we got here? Oh, there's two elks. Oh, go away. Right, well, one of them's going to like move into the path of the the snowy fur. So that's not too bad. They're going to get stuck there. I do need to put something out though. I'm Otherwise, I will just get attacked. Uh, this doesn't feel like a great starting line. I, I've got, like, one bone to start with. Like, I guess if I put the squirrel down and summon the ant, I will be able to summon one of these. Wait, the, the possum's toxic. Ooh. Oh, but they will attack after me, so the opossum will also just die because of one health. Maybe I should have buffed the possum <laughs> with the help thing. Oh, well, live and learn. Uh, oh my goodness, Maya, hello! It's been a long while since you were able to catch me live. Oh, I am so happy to see you, though. Thank you for stopping in. But I am I'm loving this so much. I'm, I'm still... I don't actually know how big the game is. I still feel like I'm fairly early in the game. But I have no idea like the span of like how long it'll take me to play this especially because i am a notoriously slow gamer like it could be the kind of game where some people finish it in like a couple of goes and for me it will take me like two months <laughs> but i'm i don't mind that because i'm just i'm just enjoying the ride oh wait there, there is the stinky so a card will lose a power trying to fight the stink bug it might be worth putting putting the bug down might be worth putting him somewhere, like, like this spot, because the elk's going to move to here. I don't want it to be open, because they'll just attack me. Oh, but then there is the, the evolve as well, which is scary. It's very scary. Okay, I'm going to do a squirrel. going to sacrifice it to bring out an ant, which is just going to go, like, there, I guess. And then I'm bringing out the stink bug. And you're gonna go there. And I'm going to pray. Yeah, back in the game, yeah! I'm gonna pray. Let's just see how it goes. If everything goes horrendously, I do have my hourglasses. Let's see. It's, a, it's okay to start with. Wait, they didn't move though. Oh, now they move, okay. They moved after attacking. Right, well... I'm not gonna get a squirrel, actually. I'm gonna try my luck. Oh, six! Nah. Oh, and it's not the Rattler with the Sigil, either. Th that's awful. Like, any other card would have been better than that. Well, this, this has no power against the Stink Bug, at least. But it will take a damage from attacking. But it will also just kill the the fawn so oh and then they're more powerful in the background 
you know what? I feel like this is a bit spicy and I don't like it, so I am actually going to use the hourglass. You'll pass your next turn. So this turn I will go attack, attack, and then start my turn, attack, attack, and I'll just win. <laughs> That's my plan. That's my plan. It's the whole plan. Got him, got him. You're obligated to pass. Yep. Yep, which means... Oh, I got that too. And then I just go and win. There we go. <laughs> got him. Ah. Uh, oh, wait, I just realized this path had the trapper. Oh, the trapper was on this path. I could have uh, spent some of my teeth. Oh, I didn't think about that. I, I, I don't think I could see that far ahead when I started on the path. Oh, that's a shame. Well, I guess I've got another cave. <laughs> yeah, definitely some parts that could take a while depending on strats or just luck. You've seen some horrific luck from some runs. I feel like so far my luck hasn't been super bad. And I feel like um, my strategy has also been working out too. Like I've been planning what to do and it's actually been paying off. So I feel like it has been going fairly well in that front, but uh, I'm also very much overthinking a lot of things a lot of the time, <laughs> which makes it take a bit longer, but also I don't want to die. So I'm going to do my best. Also, Zarok, hello, welcome. I'm glad you approve of the title. I need to do this more often. So many people have complimented the title today. I need to just, I need to think harder about my titles in the future, clearly. <laughs> but uh, welcome, welcome. All right, let's see what we got. We got... A trial of blood needs to cost at least four blood to pass. Uh, three sigils and five bones. Right, well, here are all my cards. I still think the sigils are the way to go. Especially now that I've got another card with a sigil too, so I've increased the chance a little bit more. Yeah, we go sigils. Wisdom. Every time. I'm gonna be wise. <laughs> Let the trial of wisdom begin. Oh, I saved it with myself. I saved it with myself. Oh, that was... I, I don't want this rattler anymore. <laughs> I don't want this rattler anymore. I just... I want to get rid of it. But it's okay. I saved it. The fact that I've, I've got two sigils saved me. Yes, two from the Leary. Oh yeah, saw that when you were watching the VOD. I got to the first of the, yeah, the slide puzzles all oh, on the thing. <laughs> yeah, I was, um, I was definitely overthinking that a lot, but I loved those. I had a lot of fun figuring that out. Whew, I made it though. The, the Lurie. The Lurie, the one and only. With the little angry face. Success. Whew, that was close and scary but i did it oh beehive oh bees wait flying beehive it has no attack <laughs> i love that it has no attack but it's just like hey um a card with this sigil will attack from the air the non-attacking beehive what the heck is this What is this? Huh? Huh? Hello? What are, you? what are you? What are you? What is... Oh. Guessing it's card counter. Oh. So the value represented by attack is, I am i don't know what it is, but it's probably something related to cards and amounts of cards in some way. Clearly. <laughs> also, thank you for the hydrate and posture check. And oh, it's 7.30. Oh, 7.30 a.m. Oh my goodness. <laughs> yes, thank you for stopping in. Thank you, I will have a big stretch. And another sip of my monster. But thank you for stopping in. Thank you for the, the care package. I will have a wonderful stream. I already am. Yes, yeah, sun, sun is well and truly up in the sky now. Oh, I, I really cannot say anything because I couldn't sleep last night. I didn't actually get to sleep today until 
about 9 a.m. I think it was. <laughs> it was so late in the morning, and I was like, do I even try and sleep now? And then I was like, no, you know what? I do need sleep. I need sleep for inscription. And so I just slept in the day instead. <laughs> And then it was so funny because I woke up and there was nobody in the house except me and Tiffany. And I have had no idea where everyone was, but uh, my mum and Sandra had just gone shopping. <laughs> I just woke up to this kind of silence and just Tiffany sleeping on the bed. And I was just like, oh, oh, I guess it's just me. <laughs> also, Artem, hello. Welcome, welcome. But yes, oh, started yawning though, so it means it's sleep time. Yeah, that sounds like a... A good sign, like, if, if you can feel your eyes going a bit, that's the time to close them. But thank you for stopping in. I have no idea what this is. This, it's so interesting how there's, like, little bits. It's, like, the value is something to do with a number of cards. Maybe, like, the cards I'm holding in my hand? Because it does look like the hand. So that could be a good one if I just keep drawing loads of cards and not playing them. And, like, if I have, like, six cards in my hand, then this would do, like, six damage, maybe? I don't know. Anyway, I haven't even looked at the third one yet. So... Oh, Sparrow? <laughs> wait, an Ant Sparrow? Oh! Wait, when I when I play an... Uh, if, I, if I play this Sparrow, it'll bring me an Ant. Wait, that's, that's quite cute, actually. <laughs> That's really cute to think about. Just the thought of playing a sparrow and it gives me an ant as a gift. <laughs> right, I'm, I am I think I'm just going to pick this card. Like this, I am intrigued. I am very intrigued by this card. So I'm going to, I'm going to go for whatever the heck this tentacle mystery is. Mine. I don't know what you are, but I will soon. Let's move on to here. Oh, and it's a sacrifice one. Yes. Sparrow with a little ant in its beak. Yes. <laughs> it's it's interesting to think about. It would be hard to carry an ant without squishing it. Right, so... Am I your choice? No, I, do, I don't want to sacrifice the stink bug. It keeps showing up here with the stink bug to sacrifice, but I don't want to. Because the stink bug is clearly sentient, and it's also just been a sweetheart this whole time, I don't want to sacrifice you, even if it does mean I could make someone else smelly. Oh, but I do like the item more though. <laughs> ah, oh, I could do the ant queen. Hmm. I'm not actually playing the ant queen. I think because of, like, the two blood cost, there's always things that I would rather play instead of the Ant Queen. But I could still just get, like, an army of ants in my hand. <laughs> By sticking it on something else. Oh, but then... Uh, I'm not going to be playing the pack rat either. Like, let's, let's get that... Let's get the item sigil on someone else. Am I your choice? It could be. Could be. Oh, I could stick a sigil on this horrible rattler that I keep drawing. <laughs> uh, oh, but I'll bet you anything. If I if I add a sigil to this rattler, then I'm not going to draw it anymore and I'll draw the ant. I can just tell. I'm, I'm going to do it. Am I going to do it? I'm going to do it, yeah. <laughs> Give me items. I'm, I'm not ever actually going to play it <laughs> in a fight. <laughs> I just want it to have a sigil. All right, time for another totem fight. Um, what's the worst that can happen, right? I see, I see the boss. Oh, oh, it's a raven. Oh, smelly ravens. Oh no. No, I'm fighting. Oh, nice top deck. <laughs> Oh, the cage wolf! Oh, is this my time? Is this my time? Is this my time? Am I gonna put down the beehive caged wolf? And hopefully break the cage? I, I feel like it will probably break the cage if it if it keeps getting hit. But if I get a bee every time... 
This is silly. This is really, really silly. This is incredibly silly. I want the wolf. Oh, they're smelly. Fighting the smelly ravens and the smelly raven eggs. I don't like this. I mean, it's like I could, like, totally, totally cheese it and, like, skip turns and just, like, win that way. Uh... If I want to get the cage wolf down, I think I'm going to have to sacrifice the stoat and the stink bug. Because if I play the squirrel, sacrifice that, I'll get a bone. I can summon stink bug, I can summon stoat, and then I would have to out to put the wolf on the field. I would then just have nothing though, until I get my army of bees. Okay, you know what? I'm, th I feel like this is bad. I feel like this is the, a really, really bad strategy that's probably not going to pay off. I don't think it's gonna work. But the idea is so funny, I wanna do it anyway. <laughs> So I'm going to play that as well, and then I'm going to sacrifice both of them to add a wolf in a cage with bees. What am I doing? Okay, yeah, that's the one that just like moves around, so I guess I'll put it like here. Good play, fine. See it, the stink bug compliments me. It's just like, yeah, you, you're doing great. Yeah. This is, this feels like I've made really bad choices. But maybe it'll work. Like, if this does work, it's going to be great. <laughs> All right, let's, let's go. I'm, I'm going to be hit for quite a bit, I think. Although I don't think the eggs hatch just yet. They still have zero attack at the moment, so I'll only take one damage. All right, hit me. No, it didn't move because of the egg being in the way. <sighs> no, I need to... No, but then when it hatches, it's going to be a raven. And it's going to be in the air. <laughs> mistakes. Many mistakes. I made all of the mistakes. Hmm. <laughs> I should have put it in the end one. I should have put it there. I should have put it there. Uh. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna actually use the hourglass. And I'm gonna pray. I'm gonna pray. I'm gonna hope that luck will be on my side with whichever card I shall next draw. Please, please believe in the heart of the cards. <laughs> Oh, oh. That can work, that can work. And kill the, the elk fawn. Okay, okay. I got something. I have something. I, I hate that I've got all these ravens lined up with the, the caged wolf in the way. <laughs> but it's okay. Okay. Yeah, the ravens evolve. I think I, just, I might just perish here. Yeah, there we go. I just lost. Yeah. yeah. It's okay. I hoped for more. So did I. So did I, buddy. I'm... That wasn't my, my strongest... That wasn't my best idea. <laughs> right, okay, here... Oh, I, I don't have any pelts. Hi. Show you some exquisite pelts. I don't have any. Yeah, I, I don't have any. I'm, I'm a pathetic loser with no pelts. Do you understand how disappointing that is? I'm, I'm also disappointed, don't worry. I must give you this. Use that to buy some, did, did you just give me more teeth? Okay, okay. Do not return empty-handed again. Okay, I have a warning now. I've been warned. I think that was my one get-out-of-jail-free. I need pelts the next time. 
Oh, but I can get some items at least. Okay, please give me some good items to stock up with. I need them. Oh. <laughs> yes. The skip a turn. The bone, the bone piggy bank could be really useful. In a pinch. Yes. And. Oh. And a black coat. Okay. So I've got like emergency blood sacrifice, emergency bone get. Hopefully okay. Who are? Whoa. Oh, this is gonna be the like the hunter, isn't it? This this is like the hunter. This looks like a hunter. I think I'm about to fight the hunter. Because <laughs> I had the the prospector for like the the mining in the first area. We had the angler for the fishing in the second. This is this is the hunter. This is a hunter. Look at that. Got the trap. Got the knives. A man stood before you. A man you recognized immediately. Oh, do I? It was the trapper. Oh, the trapper. No, that makes... Wait, the same trapper? The trapper I bought the pelts from? You reached out to examine his wares, but he stopped you. Oh, oh boy, okay. Oh, all right. Okay. Sorry, but today you will supply the pelts. Oh, no. I don't want to. I, I, oh, what's that? That's a lot of knives! That's a lot of knives! Hi! Oh my goodness, hi! Uh, whoa, unlimited blade works! Oh, the caged wolf! Oh, if I can get the caged wolf out. That would be very good. Whoa! Okay, there's a bunch of strange frogs that attack airborne. And there's a leaping trap. Uh, when a card bearing the sigil perishes, the creature opposing it perishes as well. A pelt is created in your hand. <gasps> oh. I can get my own pelts by sacrificing creatures. That might genuinely be a good start. Like, if I get, like, the, the ant, maybe. I don't know what I want to do. I'm wondering if I use my skipper turn immediately. I'm just really scared because I know this has got like two phases. And I don't have the most solid start with what I have here. Oh, because what does that do again? Yeah, it'll move in the direction inscribed and creatures in the way will be pushed. Actually, oh, this could be good. This could be really good to have. Have this and I'll start it on the left, hit the strange frog. I'll move over to get the next frog. Move over, get the next strange frog. If I can like make sure another one gets the trap before that happens. This might be my play. This could be the play, maybe. Yeah, oh, I really love the music. Yeah, the music is so fitting in this game. It's so good. Also, Resta, hello! Welcome, welcome! Welcome to Inscription. I'm, I've, I've been making really, really bad decisions. But I want to make good ones now. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do Squirrel. I'm going to sacrifice the Squirrel to get Black Goat. Which gives me three blood. And then I'm summoning my Moose Buck to take out this strange frog. And I think that's all I can do. Okay, let's see how it goes. Let's see how it goes. Frog to strange. <laughs> the, oh, wait, no, it just... Oh, I may have made a mistake here. I think I just made a horrific mistake. I think I just lost my moose bug. I just realized these strange frogs literally have like trap mounts. I, I think I made a big mistake. I think my moose is about to die. <laughs> I think I made a mistake. <laughs> I think I made a mistake. Let's see if I made a mistake. 
It became a trap now. Okay. Oh, but because I moved. It became a trap. So, like, in the next turn, if you didn't have a moving card, you would then hit the trap and they would die. But because I've got the moose buck, which is going to just keep going across, I actually did this quite well. This actually set up pretty well. Okay, now what I'm going to do is get squirrel. <sighs> squirrel here. I am going to have my worker ant set off this trap. And get an ant pelt, I guess. How does that even work? <laughs> also, dip shittyan. Hello, welcome. Welcome, welcome. Ooh. This does sound like Yu-Gi-Oh! narration. It is I. I'm the secret NPC from the Yu-Gi-Oh! universe. Believe in the heart of the cards. Give me an ant pelt, I guess. No, I just got a bone from the ant, I guess, because you can't get a pelt from it. <laughs> you can't get a pelt from an ant, so I just I just got a bone instead. No, I got a wolf pelt. Uh huh, okay. Okay, I'll take it. That's th uh, all right. Okay. Oh, what do I do now? <laughs> well, this frog's kind of just stuck behind the trap. I guess I got a squirrel for now. There's not really much I can do. But I don't think there's much that he can do either. I think we're in a really weird stalemate situation at the moment, so I'm I'm gonna see how this goes. I got that, I'll move over. Oh, there's a wolf there now. Okay. It's the Rattler! Oh, wait, this is the one I can just sacrifice over and over. Oh, but I don't have a safe spot to put it because of all these traps. <laughs> the traps are set off. Ugh. Oh, I, I don't think I even have enough bones. No, I've got five. I need six. I mean, if I sacrifice a squirrel, that's not a problem. I would really like to get the caged wolf out and just get loads of bees. I don't know if it's a good idea. Like, do I keep the wolf buck here? Or do I replace it for a caged wolf? I kind of... <laughs> oh, this. see, this is the problem. I get so torn with indecision. I come up with like three ideas and then I don't know which one to do. And I dither. I feel like the fact that I can make pelts is making me wonder if I'm gonna need pelts in this fight. Like, there's always a gimmick in the second half. I'm wondering if it's gonna be like a, a pelt gimmick. Hmm. 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 All right, well this bullfrog is just stuck at the back at the moment because <laughs> of the traps. <laughs> But yeah, this wolf's gonna come down and attack the moose buck. So it, it would be a really easy way to break the wolf cage. I don't know if I should do that. It's the problem. Maybe I just pass and I'll, I'll do three damage and then just see what happens next. I, I think I'm gonna do that. Oh, you're moving back. No, I didn't. Oh, I didn't realize it did move back. Oh, no, this, this. Oh, oh look, that works. <gasps> yes, yes. Give me a squirrel. Give me a squirrel. Oh, I'm, I'm so excited. I can't click properly. Give squirrel. Give squirrel. 
Get rid of these squirrels. I'm putting a caged wolf here. <laughs> Give me bees. <laughs> but I will lose my moose buck now. But hopefully I'll get a really nice pelt from it, maybe. Who knows? <sighs> yes, it's, it's time for the bees. Also, Bunny Frog, hello! Nice to see you! How am I doing? I'm doing really well, thank you. Um, not, not so much in the game. It's definitely not my best, <laughs> my best showing. I'm being a little silly with some of my decisions, but I'm, I'm enjoying it. I'm having fun. <laughs> but welcome, welcome. I, I want bees. I want the bees. It's like I could bring in the rattler too and just immediately. No, I think I'm gonna save the rattler for when I need blood for something, so I can sacrifice it. Yeah, I think I just end and we'll see how things go. Yeah, honestly, this moose going back and forth was a beautiful way to cl clear out those frogs. Like, that was... I'm, I'm really proud of this moose. A good moose. Thank you so much. You did so good. Goodbye, friend. Goodbye, friend. It's still just a regular wolf pelt. But I do get a bee. <laughs> You get a bee, and I will get another bee next turn. <laughs> oh, there's an adder there. Oh. Well, I'm just gonna wait for that to come forward. It'll only do like one damage to me, and then I'll kill it. Hmm. Shall I? Shall I sacrifice my bee <laughs> to get another pelt? <laughs> oh, hi. Oh, it's my stoat friend probably shouldn't play you in this fight. I might do it anyway. Yeah, the, the floaty knives are terrifying. It's so... <laughs> I'm so on edge. I'm so tense because of it. Alright, you know what? Let's, let's sacrifice a bee. <laughs> sacrifice a bee. I'm not doing any direct damage, and I will take one damage. But I think it's okay. Yeah, I'm happy to take a damage here. Got me another pelt. Okay, I, I broke the cage. Whoa, I got an achievement! <gasps> Whoa, freed the wolf! Oh! I was right. Oh my goodness, I was right. I was right. Oh, I feel so smart. <laughs> oh, I love when I guess things right. <laughs> oh, I love guessing things right. Oh, it's so satisfying. Oh my goodness. So I, I broke the cage. Now I have a wolf. It didn't just like get damaged. I have a wolf now. Out of the cage. And also I'm guessing the cage has gone from the, the statue. What was that? Don't worry about it. I'm sure it was nothing. Okay, yeah, I'm... Things are looking a little spicy. So now I think it's time to... You won't allow me to play a card before I draw, draw a new one. Okay, that's fair. Whoa, I got the... Oh! Oh, this could be the perfect opportunity to check if this is actually about, like, how many cards are in my hand. But the, there's two phases. Like, what if, like, at the end of my first phase, it just turns everything into a pelt? Like, uh... well, I'm going to kill that wolf. I want to kill the, um, the adder. How best to kill the adder? I, I guess the rattler? The rattler can do like really good like direct damage over here. So maybe... Do I bring in the stone? <laughs> right, well I know I, I do want my rattler right here. To do direct damage. 
I do want to do that much. Now I just have to make my next decision. Like, I could just leave it there and it just hits me for one. But I would like to take it out. I'm just worried if I place the stoat, something bad might happen. <laughs> bad play. <laughs> no, I, I feel like the stoat would call anything I do a bad play. It would just be like, well, you thought of it, so it's got to be bad. I've got so many pelts as well now. See, the problem is, if I play the bee, I won't actually attack the adder because of um, the bee being airborne. So I'll do, like, one direct damage, but then the adder will just kill the bee. But the stoat can just kill it. You know what? I'm going to risk it. I'm gonna risk it for the biscuit. Might go badly. You sure? Yes! And, uh, ha -ha, let's see how this goes. Okay. The scales have tipped in my favor. I think I'm gonna win on the next turn. Yeah, I, I can just win right now for this round at least. But I don't know what's gonna happen in the next round, so I think getting a squirrel is probably safe. Let's see what happens. Oh, 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 oh. Huh? Too fast. Too soon. Huh? What? Excuse me? Well, um... to do here? <gasps> I can take out one of them. <laughs> I can take out one of them at least. This isn't good. Uh, ha -ha. Wow. Wow, he is mad. Well, I guess all of these are dying, but at least I'll take one of them out. Uh, I don't even know what I can do. Perish, I guess. Goodbye. I got me. I got me. I do four damage. I don't think it's enough. I think I just die here. Unless like I I, I can do the hourglass. I could I could try an hourglass. I'm I am just gonna like perish, I think, but I I wanna at least take out one with me. <laughs> I may go down, but I'm gonna go down in style, darn it. Wait, what is that? Hello? Oh, I forgot I give my <laughs> the item sigil. <laughs> Wait, it's a frozen opossum. Wait, that's yeah, let's the uh, block block there too, sure. Why not? I'll still take eight damage. I can't survive that. But oh no, wait. Do I hourglass? Wait, what's that? Oh, that's the, the the bones. Yeah, okay. Hourglass, you'll pass your next turn. My go. Again. Oh, well, next. Next turn. There we go. Now there's the pass. I level myself up. Please give me something. It's... Uh. What if I just put all the wolf pelts down? 
wait, actually, I have an idea. I actually have an idea. Oh. Oh, I wonder if he'll get mad if I do this. Okay. 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 Check out my master plan, my incredible masterful master plan. Pelt. Squirrel. Direct damage. Five. I should win. <laughs> I should win. I win? <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Oh, your lives are restored. Oh my goodness. <laughs> I saved myself. Wall of pelts, the wall of pelts strategy. <laughs> oh my God, having those pelts and just being able to put them out to like defend myself was beautiful. Oh, your lives are restored. My heart is beating so fast after that. I, that is like... I got such an adrenaline rush from that fight. Like, I was going to just give up. I was ready to give up seeing, like, a wall of bears. But then I was like, what if? What if? Your lives are restored. Whew. Defeated the trapper and the trader. Huh? Choose carefully. Whew, okay, hold on. I, I need a drink after that. I'm <laughs> that was thrilling. My hand's actually shaking now. I've, I, I got such an adrenaline rush from that. That was like a roller coaster. That was like the adrenaline rush I get like at the top of a roller coaster about to go down. Oh, my hands are so shaky. Thank you for the hydrate. Thank you. Thank you for the posture check too. I need to have a, a big stretch. Also, yeah, the quietness feels so, so tense, especially like after that fight with the, the super sinister music. The silence is deafening. Right, let's see what cool cards I've got. Child 13, which is the, the sacrifice over and over one. Amoeba. The amorphous amoeba. Its sigils are ever changing. That sounds chaotic. I like it. And the holy mantis god, a perfect incarnation of terror. Oh, see, I was going to go for the amoeba, but now that I've seen it. Wait, that's the three prong. Oh, my. That. Oh, mine. Oh. With the enigmatic trapper and trader now bleeding into the snow, you persisted. Were they the same person then? It's like the trapper and the trader. It's, hmm. I love the thought of like the same person just like putting on a mask, like, like just being like, hello, I'm a different person now. Hey, um, I'll sell you this, you buy this. Weird exchanges. With the enigmatic trapper and trader now bleeding into the snow, you persisted. You could see a light in the distance. The end is near. Oh! Oh? Hmm. Oh, yes, I know. Ooh. Uh, I think sentence works whether it's one person or two. Well, I only defeated one person, though. Your eyes were not red before. Your eyes were very much not red before. I'm getting my wolf. Oh, and, and more, more teeth. Don't mind if I do. The wolf is out of the cage. Okay, I have a wolf. What am I doing with this wolf? Can I put it with the squirrel? Yeah, there's like a space here. Is that where wolf goes? <gasps> it is. Knife. Whoa! You finally pried my special dagger from the paws of that squirrel. Though you may wish that you hadn't. What does this do? Okay. Oh, ah. 
everything suddenly feels considerably more ominous than before. <laughs> Considerously, considerably more ominous. Okay, wait, is... Is that my cabin? Is that where we are? Am I gonna like finish this and then something will burst through the door? <laughs> oh, which do I do? Ooh, items, items. I, I want to stock up on items. Whew. Oh, scissors to cut up a card. Yes. Okay. Okay, so I have scissors. I have um, the, the piggy bank full of bones. And I have this special dagger, which I have no idea what it does, but I'm sure it is fine and safe. Ooh. Okay, encounter. Your eyes affix themselves on the small cabin. It's warm light a beacon in the oppressive darkness of the night. Surely, surely this cabin marked the end of your travails. I can move. Oh. oh, what's behind me? Black. What happens if I just keep going backwards? There's a tree. Okay, I can't keep going backwards. Okay. All right. <laughs> oh. Oh. Hi. Oh. Hello? Oh! Steps away from the strange cavern, you were presented with an opportunity. I don't offer my boons to just any traveler. Oh, I want boons. If you are able to pass my trials, you will be rewarded mightily. I like the sound of being rewarded. The trial of the finned. I don't have waterborne. The Trial of the Winged. I don't think I have Airborne. The Trial of Skins. The Three Drawn Cards. I don't know. What? I'm in trouble. <laughs> I don't have any of these, so I've got to go for the Pelt one. But uh, d did it, like, fully turn my cards into the Pelts then, I wonder? One way to find out. <laughs> Let the trial of skins begin. <laughs> this is... Yeah, I, 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 just, I do not pass this trial. Nope, not a single pelt card. Failure. We will repeat that once more. This... I'm, I'm not passing any of these. I'm not going to pass any of these, I can tell. Uh, the three drawn cards must include a rare card. I could do that one. Trial of rarity. Uh, the Trial of the Ring. If you have a ring, you pass automatically. How do we get a ring? I don't have a ring. The Trial of the Swift. The three drawn cards must include a card with a sprinter sigil. I don't have a ring. How, oh, how, how do we get a ring? I want a ring. Well, I don't think I have any with that, and I don't have a ring, so I guess it's got to be the, the rare one. Come on. Let the Trial of Rarity begin. I did it! I got the- oh, my mantis god! My mantis god! My mantis god! Ah! Ah, uh, mantis god is a rare card. Success! Oh my goodness. Ooh. Ooh. I will grant you one of my most powerful boons. Cards that dramatically alter the game, and you don't even need to draw them. Oak, I like that. I like that. Okay. The boon of goat's blood. You will start a battle with a black goat on the board. Wait, that's good. The boon of the magpie's eye. When you draw from your deck, you may choose any wow. card in your deck to draw. Huh? The boon of the ambidextrous. You may draw twice at the beginning of your turn. Oh, these are amazing. Wow. Oh, these are all so good. Ooh, I, I don't know what I... 
what I want. I, I really like the ambidextrous. I, I like the idea of just having loads of cards. I just want lots of cards. Ah, I'm, I'm going to do it. I'm not going to overthink it. I'm just going to go for it. Okay, I got a boon. All right. Slowly. Ooh! Hi! Hello! Oh! You managed to get a boon! I did! Hi! This may be a fair competition. Why do I get the feeling this isn't going to be a fair competition at all? <laughs> I am terrified. This, this is terrifying. This is... Okay. Hello? Oh, oh, hi. Hi. <laughs> I beat the wall of bears. Have confidence. You're right. You're right. You're right. I did indeed beat the wall of bears. I feel proud of myself. I can do this. I think I can do this. Walk. I was walking. I, I did. I stepped forward and it still wasn't doing anything. <laughs> it just took a while. It's okay. Wow. Hello. I like how before I like mentioned like 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 trees. I mentioned it looked like tree branches before and I was actually right. <laughs> oh, and like mushrooms in the beard. Oh. You took your time out there. Yes, because I was terrified. I I needed a second to catch my breath. Thank you very much. And I'm itching for another game. Oh. <laughs> This feels very final boss. I'm scared. It's just a friendly card game, right? It's it's just friends having a good time. Also, I just realized I didn't say hi. Hi, Primal Zed. <laughs> I think you joined right as the middle of everything happened all at once. But welcome, welcome. Are you ready to play? I, I don't know, am I? I guess so. Oh, oh, I hope you are adequately prepared. I don't think I am. Oh, wait, I've got this dagger, though. Maybe, maybe the special dagger will be of use in this. Let's see how this goes. Oh, cheetah. Oh, at least I get the smoke, though. Oh, perhaps one more to be safe. You filthy rotten cheater. You're a cheater. You're a, you are a, a cheaty cheat cheat. Whoa. Oh, it's all the masks passing over. Oh, this is going to be mechanics from all three of the fights, isn't it? I don't, I don't want this. I don't want this. What's going on? There's a mole man. Great. There's a mole man with six health, and also... Amalgam? I see I showed up at an interesting time, LMAO. Amalgam? You did indeed join at an interesting time! Hello! Welcome! Thank you so much for the reset for 22 months! And also, bad guy! Welcome, welcome! Boss battle, here we go! I'm so ready! I'm so ready! I'm ready. I'm good. But, uh, I'm okay for... For anything the game throws at me, so um, don't worry about content warnings. I've got a feeling I know the kind of stuff this game would try and pull, so I'm prepared for literally anything. I'm just imagining the worst, so. Okay, I've got my, my smoke. Smoke is good to start with. Get a bunch of bones straight off the bat. So I think... Yeah, I'll start with the smoke over here. But, uh, <laughs> have to check out the board to see what you missed. Yes, I, I had, like, my most powerful gamer moment. I felt really proud of myself with how things went. <laughs> I do have myself, though, which is going to help me here, I think. 
do I do I put myself to to battle the mole man? I'm just really scared for like the three candles, the three phases, three stages. I don't like that. Yeah, because the mole man just like pops up if I try to attack like in the empty space. So. Oh, this might be a good time for my bones. I still don't have enough for the rattler, but I will if I sacrifice my squirrel and get myself out. So I think that's exactly what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna get my squirrel out. Sacrifice squirrel for me. Whoa, and I get a free boulder. Thank you, myself. Wait, how does the item one work again? Is it? It's only when it's played, okay. Like, it would be so broken if I could just keep getting items from it. <laughs> but a bold is nice to have. And... Then I'm gonna bring my Rattler out as well. And the Mole Man will pop up to attack the Rattler. Like, the Mole Man will tank both of the hits, but then I will still do direct damage afterwards. So I think it will go well. I may regret this as soon as the phase changes and I lose all my items because they're probably going to turn into gold. It, it's going to be like a three phase thing and they will turn into gold, I bet. I bet. But that's okay. Let's go. Yep, it's the prospector. Knew it! I knew it! Ah. But I get two. Pick one from each deck. And there's an ant. Great. Oh. I will just win this round by just attacking now. And then I'm going to lose my rattler and me, I guess. <laughs> to become gold, I guess. I mean, I could put a squirrel down here to, like stick a lump of gold there so that the amalgam has to like <laughs> I don't know if that'd work or not let's, let's try it attack attack yes end of the first phase there we go you capably endured the onslaught of rare creatures but the true challenge was forthcoming shadowy figures appeared before you in their eyes glimmered a recognition of kinship but colored by guilt. They were betraying you. I swear to God, if this is the stoat, I'm gonna be, hello? No, I am being used against myself. No. And who's Lewis? Hello. I remember that one fondly. Oh, I knew it. I knew I would be used against myself. I... I'm silly. I need my poison one. I need my... <laughs> oh, Mantis God, though. That's pretty nice to have. I need... I need to get my, my poison opossum. I wish I'd gotten the boon where I could just draw any... Oh, wait, no, the coyote as well. <gasps> coyote has it too. Okay. We're okay. We're okay. We're okay, we're all right. I'm not putting it out yet because I need to wait for myself to move forward and hit me for a bunch of damage, I guess. Ow. But oh, I guess I could just like. Hmm. I can sacrifice the squirrel and stick an ant over here because then I'll only take the three damage from the amalgam instead of the four from myself. I think I'm gonna do that. I think I'm gonna squirrel ant because the amalgam only hits for three, I hit for four and I'm gonna just kill the ant immediately so that will leave the space open for coyote to destroy myself. Yeah. 
I will take three damage, which is a little painful. But I can take it. I can take it. Oh! There it is. I, I, oh, I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Ugh. Oh, you're a... Oh, oh. Kaminsky? Why at the... No. What is this? What the heck? Well, whatever. I'm... Okay, I've got to draw first. Okay. All right. Okay. All right. Okay. Okay. All right. Oh, hi! Hi! Fancy seeing you here. Welcome. You joined at a great time. I'm killing myself. I'm doing it. I'm taking myself out. <laughs> this is an imposter. This is not me. This Leary's gotta go. This is the wrong one. <laughs> oh, and this awful card. These awful water cards. What the heck does this one do? Oh, so if I play a creature opposite an empty space, that one will just pop up. Well, ah, uh, yeah, that's... Uh. You know what? I think it's boulder time. <laughs> boulder time. This isn't looking good. Oh, what is I don't even know what the dagger does. Oh, wait, ooh. <gasps> hmm. You will place a weight on the scales. The pain is temporary. All right, so the pliers make me pull my teeth out. I'm probably going to remove a limb with this and stick it on the scales, I bet. I think I'm gonna try it. I might regret this. I might wait until the next turn. I'm gonna wait until the next turn. <laughs> I think I can, I can definitely survive this turn, I think. I don't remember what this card's, like, effect and damage was, and it's flipped over now, so I can't tell. So, like, if this one doesn't kill me in one hit, I'll be okay. But, uh, oh, wait, what if I... What if I cut it up? This annoying card. Annoying card. There. And now... Stale, hard choose. The angler! I forgot about the angler. What are you gonna hook? Yeah, hook the boulder. I don't care. Do not care. Hook the boulder. Do it. I I simply do not care. I'm alive right now. And that's all I care about. All these people, there's so many people. There's so many people. Oh my goodness. Oh, I don't even know what I should do here. Oh, it's really not... I'm not in a very good situation here. They are just going to destroy the gold nuggets and then I will have space to actually play cards. So, let's get a squirrel. And another card from here. It's the stoat! Oh, hi! Hello! Nice to see you. Okay, I will... I'll do two direct damage and then these ones can't really do anything. Oh, but if the boulder's hooked, will this one then just deal me three damage? I don't know when it's going to be hooked. Is the thing. Do I do it now? I don't even know how heavy this will be. I don't even know if this will fully weigh the scales. I'm... I'm going to do it. was my eye, wasn't it? <laughs> oh my goodness, everything's blurry now as well. Oh. oh my goodness, this is so funny. This is exactly what I see when I don't have my glasses on in real life. This is... <laughs> oh my god. Wow, it's still not enough 
like to do it, but it's like it makes sure that if I am hit, I won't immediately lose. So I'm okay with this. I'm okay with this. Alright. Oh, it pulled it up! Oh, wait, that's actually great! Take fish, go fish. I didn't need to do that at all. <laughs> oh, I forgot that has like the prong attack. Oh, goodbye, my coyote. Oh, I didn't have to do that at all, but it's it's okay. Oh, I can't. I can't see what's going on on my right anymore. My my poor right eye. This is so sad. Oof. Well, that's. Uh, I I I can't see this half of the board anymore. That's so. Wow. Wow. Squirrel and one from here. My possum! Right, I'm, I'm close to winning. I only need one more to like get to this next round. So I'm gonna do something I wouldn't mind losing. I guess the ant queen. No, that's, that's too much. What do I do? I only need to do one damage. I don't want to put the mantis god out, is the thing. You know what, the stoat's... The stoat's already mad at me. Oh, hi! The stoat's already mad at me. Get madder. <laughs> Keep me alive. I, I can't make any guarantees, but I will try. <sighs> now there's gold nuggets in the way now. Of course there is. Yeah, and this one's... Oh, but that one's going to break that gold nugget. Okay, no, that actually helps me. That's okay. That's okay. You can... Yeah, you can take one hit. Two hits. You can take two hits. Yeah, you'll still have a health left. It'll be okay. Be okay. I'm, I'm going to stock up on as many cards as I can pull. Oh! Oh, I still don't even know what this one does. <laughs> Who's that? Reginald, hi. You're, don't you kill my stoat. Well, I'll, I'll win before that happens. It's okay. Ah, do I play something in preparation is the question. Like I could put something down in preparation for the next round, but I... I'm, I'm gonna go for it because I don't know what the gimmick's gonna be. <laughs> Let's go. Oop. I win. Whoop. Okay. Last life. Oh, hi. This damned moon. It's dramatic, yes. But it provides no value to my board. Are you gonna, like... What are you gonna do to the moon? What... I wonder. <laughs> what the heck? I should have saved my scissors. I should have saved my scissors. I should have saved the scissors. I should have saved the scissors. Now that is value. What the heck? Moon has 40 health. One damage. Uh, blocks airborne sigils strikes every single space for one and at the beginning of its owner's turn a card bearing the sigil will pull small creatures like squirrels into its orbit oh no this is awful this is really bad this is like oh <laughs> can I poison the moon <laughs> hold on Maybe I could poison the moon. <laughs> Hold on. This is my only chance now. It's my only chance now. I'm gonna try kill the moon. I'm wondering whether to put a squirrel down just just for a laugh. Oh wait, I wonder. Whoa, this one's like the tentacles and stuff. I wonder if this could be like the, the counter it with the tide, the tide and the moon. Hmm. 
I'm gonna put it down just to see what happens. At this point, I, I don't know what's happening. I'm just, I'm going for it. Let's put these tentacles down. I don't know what they do. But we're gonna find out. Let's see what happens. I, I say as I can't see anything. <laughs> I love that sigil. I love that sigil. That, that, that I love that sigil. I love that sigil. <laughs> you really destroyed the moon. I did. I suppose all that's left is to finish me off. I, I guess so. Mm hmm. Go on. Okay. Enduring victory. Defeat Leshy. Leshy. Oh my, did I just... I think I just beat him. Oh. Hello? Whoa! Whoa! Oh my goodness! Oh my goodness! What is this? Okay, okay. Let's let's start with the earliest one. Hi. Oh, shit. Yeah, you you hit record. <laughs> All right. Let's let's check out the next one. What is happening? Hey there, card gamers. I'm the Lucky Carter, and this is another pack opening video. Oh, I Today, love I am opening card Hatch opening. Monsters packs and digging for that epic, shiny Transcend Dog! And here I'll add some crazy VFX with lightning bolts or something. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, I am about to open my first pack. Feeling good about this one. Feeling I real I hope you get good. the Transcend Dog. Okay, and our first rare is a Birchkin. Ooh. Not exactly a viable competitive card, but mm -hmm. hey, it's a pretty one. I, right. I'm here for the pretty cards, honestly. I'm. <laughs> Next pack. Feeling even better about this one. Yes. I think you're going to get say, it. These cards are feeling extra silky today. Ooh. I mean, they're so smooth. Not sure what they're doing down there at the uh, the card factory, but um, <laughs> these are feeling good in my hands. Okay, let's see what we got here. Some jank cards, <laughs> maybe a few additions to my draft cube. We'll see. And our rare for this pack is Bandog. Bandog. Not exactly riveting so far, but we have many packs to go. Still a dog. You're getting closer. Next pack. Here we come. Just cut out this part. I like that he's like giving himself notes for when he does the editing afterwards. He's just like, in case I forget, I'm gonna edit this out. Like, <laughs> what is this? What is happening? This is wild. <laughs> This is so wild. Also, Mukem, hello, welcome. <laughs> I'm so intrigued as to what is happening here. I don't know what's happening. This is great. Hey okay. there, card gamers. I'm the Lucky Carter, and this is a vintage pack <gasps> opening Ooh. video. Today, I'm opening a few super rare old packs I snagged at a garage sale. I hope you I've got a shiny. Four packs of inscription. Oh, you would not oh. believe the deal I got on these. Now, not all of you will even ooh, remember ooh. this game. I'm barely old enough to have uh, seen these going around in my childhood. Oh. Uh, for whatever reason, what cards really are you get one set of these cards and then stop printing them. Uh, there's not a huge market for them anymore, but at the rate I got them for, there's not really much to lose. Tell me, tell me said, what they do. A foil mantis god goes for a couple hundred bucks. Oh. So, fingers crossed. Let's see what you get. Really cool art on these. Definitely <laughs> stands the test of time. And our rare for this pack is Blue Mage. Cool looking Hello. card, but not going to be worth very much. 
All right. Oh, I wonder if it's going to be like the adventures second. around the campfire. <laughs> huh. Uh, huh? This pack has been opened. Oh. And resealed. Hope no one snuck a rare out of it. Or maybe they snuck one in. Suck. Eh -heh -heh. Come on, people. Honestly. Who opens and reseals a pack? Yeah, in such a sloppy way that you can tell it's been resealed. <laughs> There's a set of coordinates on this card. Looks like they were drawn on with a pen. Hello, hello, hello. 49 degrees north behind- Hold on. <laughs> Hold on. <laughs> oh no, I can't find my pen. Okay, I found my pen. <laughs> ha, ha, ha. Okay. 49 degrees north. 123 degrees west. Thank you very much. 123 degrees west. Got him. Uh, I think... I'd have to check, but I think that's pretty nearby. Oh! <laughs> That, oh, that's going to be the coordinates of the cabin, isn't it? Oh, oh. Yeah, he's actually going. He's actually going. All right, you guys. <laughs> Exciting. I'm out here living my best life. Got my trusty headlamp and shovel. Ooh. Always come prepared, kids. All right. Whew. Let's see what's here. There we go. Yeah. Okay. Oh, what is that? Oh, baby. Whew. Hold on. Hold on. Getting close. Can I, can I like, oh, I'm going to like drag it back. Assuming there no. is a thing to get close to. This very well may be a massive waste of. Oh. So I want to, I want to go back. A and... Massive. Okay. Assuming. Look at that! Look at that! What? Look at that! Okay. It's terrifying. Right, the next one has an error. That's great. Oh, I hate that sound. That was awful. Um. Okay, what's next? All right. That's why you always bring an extra battery, boys and girls. Hmm. Every time. Hmm. You gotta come prepared. Hmm. <sighs> I can't say I've ever had a camera that's done that when it's run low on battery. <laughs> Where is it? What are we finding? We're getting closer. That is All right. so weird. This is it. Okay. And now, we dig. Okay. Is that how you dig? I give a 75% chance it's a rock. But, Is oh, that no, how you like now. test for digging? Like just like hit the ground in a bunch of areas and see if like there's any resistance? I don't I don't know how to dig up items. <laughs> Is that <laughs> the Minecraft captions? Oh my God, you guys, I love I it. I can't believe it. There's actually something here. Oh, what is it? Is it gonna be like a full set of every inscription card? What? Is what? What is that? Oh my goodness, the floppy does. <laughs> What? What the fuck? <laughs> Will that Guys. even work? Like, look at all Are the dirt and this? stuff. The, the, the strip is exposed I'm, on uh... it. 
I'm a little confused. <laughs> I'm also a little confused, but I love it. I, I wouldn't want to be any other way. <laughs> Is that the same icon? No. Every time I, someone says that, they're like, oh yeah, it's the save icon. I'm like, yeah, but do you know what it is? Do you know what it is? I used to have a bunch back in the day. I remember saving little word searches I would make on my Windows 95 PC onto a floppy disk. I had some that were pink. <laughs> I spent more on floppy disks that were pink instead of the boring black ones. Just so they were pink. Ah, oh, memories. Anyway, uh, let's see if this floppy disk works, I guess. I don't. Wow, great video! <laughs> no, it actually was, though. I love that. I love that. Oh, hello! Oh, love the fact that they were sort of disposable like a piece of paper. Something you'd submit with an assignment and don't expect to receive back. Yeah, I'd have memories of just buying them in like big packs of 10. <laughs> like you, you'd just have like multiple floppy disks because once you'd stuck one thing on there, that was all you could fit. Oh, memories. Memories. Okay, time to figure out what's on this thing. Getting a, a portable floppy disk drive just to see what's on this floppy that may or may not work. It is working! Ooh! Would you look at that? Hey, I've played that game. <laughs> this guy didn't even try the new game. You just went immediately for continue. I at least tried the new game option. <laughs> okay. Stop browsing footage. Yeah, I guess so. I've, I've written down the coordinates, so. Oh, now I'm wondering if there might be something else like hidden somewhere. <laughs> no, I'm gonna stop. Stop browsing. Oh, hi. Hello. What is that? Hi? Oh, I do not celebrate often and I seldom give gifts. Oh, you, you shouldn't have. Really, you, you really, you really shouldn't have. What even is this? I'm like, it's either like meat and gore or it's just like dirt or a rock. I, I, I hope it's a rock. <laughs> But you, Challenger, you are worthy. Please do not be polite. Dig in. Oh, don't. I don't want to. I don't want to. It looks tasty. No, it doesn't. I don't want to. Can I blow the candle out instead? Is there something wrong? Yes. Um, I'm, I'm suddenly a vegetarian. Your prize awaits. Very well. Come with me. Okay. Oh, all right. Stand right there. No, don't take a photo of me. No. No, you're going to turn me into a card. You, you. The camera's going to turn me into a card. Can I steal it? Yoink. Oh. Damn it, I thought I was so clever. <laughs> Please do not be foolish. There is no film in there. <sighs> I will need that. No. Oh, okay. Okay. Great. Okay. I have a new goal. I gotta. I gotta try and try and find some film. I need to find some camera film. Oh. You, Challenger, are a champion, and I wish to commemorate your victory. <laughs> oh, thank you, thank you for the, the hydrate. I will have a sip. 
Ah. Uh. Ah. Uh. All right. Please inscribe your name. Okay. Oh, I, it's like I'm sorry. I couldn't see. Do I have to like put it? Um, I don't want to put my name this time. No, let's let's do it. Okay, I th I think I typed my name. I can't see. Shh. <laughs> do not despair. You are a winner. Oh, I really feel it right now. Not over yet. <laughs> Ooh. <laughs> the last challenger managed to defeat me. A rare event. Go and ask how they did it. You will find them hanging from the door over there. <gasps> whoa! Whoa! A gift from the angler. Oh. Having the angler's hook. That feels great. I want the moon. You see, he was defeated recently and wishes to redeem himself. It would be unfortunate if you were to fall to the prospector before he was given that chance. This hook is powerful. You may steal one of my cards with it. For that reason, you will not find any others along the path. Use it wisely. Okay. Okay. It seems the lowly stink bug has made its way in. But it is dealt, so it stands. And the stoat. Why is your head so square? Why it... They did not look like this before. Did I do this? <laughs> did I do this? What is happening? Uh Okay, now I back up. Oh, it was telling me to press S. Okay, never mind. Whoop. Okay, well Wow. Great, I guess I've got my eye back. Oh, but I have the I have the dagger on the table. Ooh wait, squirrel coyote. What was it before? It was squirrel and um the um the black black goat before. I wonder if this is um the cards I used the most. Or the cards I played the most, maybe, because I did put that coyote down quite a lot. That is interesting. Right, there's the little prospector figure. Oh! Hey! Oh I'm on the door now! Oh, <laughs> And I've only got one eye. <laughs> I only have one eye. Oh my goodness, of course. Amazing. I, th I don't like these being lit. Is that a ring? No, that's, that's like a magnifying glass. Oh! I do relish snuffing out your excess candles before a boss. Perhaps you will now enjoy it as much as I do. Did I get that because I blew that one out? Nice! Oh, there's no smoke anymore. I just claimed the smoke from it. I, I'll take those too, thank you. Whoa. Okay. Oh wait, your eye's not glowing anymore. Hello. I don't even know if this does anything, but I, I want to do it anyway. Right, oh could, oh, could the coordinates be to do with the clock? Hmm. I still haven't found anything that looks like a time. Hmm. That's new. That... These look new? Okay. Let's see. Oh, no. You may not choose a specific beast. Instead, you must now decide on a tribe that you prefer. Oh! Oh, okay. G creatures? Wolves? Stags. Mmm. 
Hmm. Interesting. Bum bum bum. Uh, also, if a, if a message was deleted um, and a moderator deleted it, uh, please don't like try to argue like, oh, it wasn't meant as like back seating or whatever. It's it's all like purely precautionary, because uh, especially for a game like this, I feel like it's the kind of thing that's probably very easy to spoil by accident. Like you can say something completely innocuous that actually turns out to like kind of change things a little bit. So it's all very much like erring on the side of caution. So if anything gets deleted, it's like. It's not like you're being fully told off or anything. It's more purely like uh, just in case. It's it's just a very just in case thing. But uh, but yeah, it's like it's it's not from a situation of like oh well, the message got deleted. I'm in trouble. They're gonna be mad at me. It's completely fine. Like that's it's why I got my mod squad. They are a, a wonderful mod squad. Thank you so much for everything. I really appreciate it. Because <laughs> I also um. I have my, like, OBS chat off when I play, like, spoilery games as well, so I don't see it until it's, like, added to my chat on screen too, so if something's deleted, sometimes I I, I don't even see it if it's deleted fast enough. <laughs> Which is really nice, because I don't want to be spoilt for something like this, because it's, it's incredible. But yeah, I, I want to go, like, creatures, like, the, the amoeba or whatever, I, I don't know what this is going to be like. That's why I'm choosing it. Oh, the mantis! A randomly chosen insect card. Do you wish for something else? I'm fine with the mantis. Yeah, I'm good with the mantis. I like the mantis. <laughs> Feels like a good start. I like having the, the prong attack. Hee hee. All right, let's do this again. And now I need to... I feel like I really need to find a time for this clock. Because, like, I'm seeing, like, these compartments. I feel like there's probably going to be, like, film reel in here. I need film. I need film for the camera. I need to somehow get Eight. film. Oh, wait. Oh, coordinates? The globe? What if I click this enough? What if I just, like... Ooh, how fast can I spin it? That's the fastest I can spin it. That's fine. <laughs> Leshy just staring at me like, what are you doing? Okay. What is this? Oh, hello. An ancient woman emerged from behind an oak tree. She carefully laid out intricate wood carvings, then gestured at them brusquely. Choose. Oh, these are totem things. Oh my. I, oh, 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 oh. I'm going to be able to make my own totem. I can make a, a squirrel totem. I can make a squirrel totem. I've got like the squirrel top. I can make a squirrel totem. Oh, this one. Power them up. They're so weak. They have nothing to begin with. But after a turn, they evolve. I'm having the evolve one. Oh. I got a totem. <laughs> the old woman bared her teeth in satisfaction. Your first totem was complete. The fledgling sigil will now be marked upon all your squirrel creatures. Oh my goodness, squirrel time. It's squirrel time. <laughs> oh my goodness, okay. Alright, well, a totem fight, but I also have a totem now. So, um, let's see how this goes. Okay, your your deer will block airborne attacks. Yep. Are you still mad at me for letting you die so often? Maybe you should just not get hit. Yeah, Stinkbug just looks like a, a little old lady now. <laughs> Like, like a little old lady, like, stirring a cooking pot about to make some soup. And the, the stoat is just... ...becoming square. <laughs> oh, I've got a bullfrog. Okay. Oh, this one has a... This one moves? 
yeah, that, that one moves, and then it also has, like, the prong attack. Interesting. Okay. Well, I think what I'm going to do is, that one's going to be, like, moving over here. I want Squirrel to, like, be alive to begin with. But I do want to get a squirrel on the board so they can start evolving, so I'm going to stick a squirrel down there. See what see what happens. And then I can just get another squirrel. Yeah. Hee <laughs> hee. Let's just put two squirrels down, why not? <laughs> Start powering up my squirrels, my squirrel army. Oh no, it killed one of them. I forgot about it. I thought it I thought it would move before the attack happened. That was on me. Well, I've now got an elder squirrel. Elder squirrel can attack now. Nice. Okay. This deck. I don't keep my boons, I guess. That that was not me. That was the, the Leary on the door who died. Oh, but I can summon a mantis. Oh, it's got like three health. Oh, but only attacks for one. So Stinky could work. Stinkbug could be good. Hmm. It's so hard from the beginning. I've gotten so used to my deck full of cards with loads of sigils. <laughs> oh, I only have one bone, though. This is a little annoying. Yeah, we'll we'll both just deal one damage. I'm just gonna like waste a turn, just even even it out. One damage. Okay, moved over now, so it will do two damage if it stays alive. But get another squirrel. And He's in Minecraft. Wait, wait, I love how we had the moment of like the, the the videos and then like the Minecraft text and now Stoat is also turning Minecraft somehow. I can't believe this. <sighs> hmm. I really think having Stinkbug on the, the field would be really, really useful here. But I, like, the fact that this is everywhere is just incredibly annoying really could do with killing that like I could put the mantis down and do one damage to it but then my mantis will die like everything I do is one damage it's all one damage I... I'll go for it Let's bring the stoat out. You have a decent amount of health, so you can at least do one damage here. And then I can also bring Stinkbug out on the next round, I think. Because... Oh no, she won't die! She's got two health. Maybe I bring her out now for a direct damage. It's gonna go this way, so then she can attack it on the next turn? If I put it here, she'll just direct hit for two turns. Actually, that's better. She'll get hit this turn, but then that one's moving away, so it's fine. Yeah, I'll go with that for now. Not optimal, but it's a little bit. Every little helps. Oh no, I should have put her there, because then this would have zero on this turn. Ne never mind. I'm really not doing well with the start. Uh, Teehee. Oh, I could just bring out a wolf. <laughs> uh, I'm sorry, Stinkbug. I love you and you're lovely. I'm actually going to sacrifice you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. But the wolf is going to kill this. It's for a good cause. There's no reason for this. 
I think I just win. I, I could have like stalled out a bit longer and just had loads of squirrels on, but it's okay. It's okay, that's the warm-up. I'm <laughs> I'm learning how to play with a new deck of cards. Alright, please give me something good. There's wolves, there's ravens, there's I'm going like creatures again. I I wonder if this is just random. No, it's the mantis. Is it all just mantis? Is it just a mantis deck? I'm I'd be okay with that. Oh. oh Oh, can I like mix and match? Wait, can I like grow my totem? Can I make like a really tall totem just with loads of power-ups? Ooh. The bones of the ancient woman creaked and groaned as she approached. With gently shaking hands, she placed her offerings before you. <gasps> Whoa. No hesitation. No hesitation. No hesitation. I have killer squirrels. Oh, but they have no attack power. Maybe that's not the best decision. Oopsie. I haven't given them attack power yet. It's, it's fine. The old woman collected her pieces and shuffled off into the darkness. It's alright. I'll figure it out. Ooh, the trapper's here. Do oh, I want some pelts? I don't really have any teeth yet. Yeah, I'm not starting with a very good deck. Are there any teeth? Any spare teeth? No. No teeth. Okay. Hmm. Oh, actually, I think I'm going to go to the left because I want to know what this is. I want to see what this is. I, I want to I wanna do some mining. Minecraft time in so many ways. <laughs> Lucky draw. Yep. Thank you for being in my starting hand. Like, because it's just like when a card damages another creature, the creature perishes, but the squirrels aren't doing any damage at the moment. So that was quite silly of me. But, um, I'm sure it'll be okay. Hmm. Hmm. I think I need Stoat to tank a hit for me. <laughs> I'm gonna need Stoat to tank a hit for me here because I, I know it's a bad play for you because you will take damage, I know that, but it's a good play for me because I won't take that two damage. <laughs> right. There we go, and that one will attack but it's okay. Ooh. Got another death squirrel, but it's... <laughs> yeah, my stoat's about to die. Yeah, this isn't great. I have a terrible starting hand here. Like, this is just not good. <laughs> yeah, Mantis is gonna die. Stoat's gonna die. Well... Oh, I did one damage at least. Yeah, there they go. All right, yep. Just two porcupines. Can I at least do like one damage? Yeah, I'll do one damage with the mantis, but then my mantis is going to die because of the spikes, I think. And then I will take two. No, that's that's really not worth it. <laughs> I'll just like wait like that, I guess. I'll I'll take one damage. 
Please. Oh, I shouldn't have done that. I should have picked a squirrel. Why did I do that? I don't have anything to sacrifice. <laughs> Well, I, I can, I can, I can take two hits. It's okay. Boom, boom. That's all right. Yeah, it only does one damage, but does have two health. No, it'll still die. Ah. Hmm. I'll at least do one damage. One damage at a time. I'll lose my mantis, but it's, it's whatever. Yep. Yep, this isn't looking great. I can kill one of the porcupines at least. So I'm gonna do that. That's, that's all I can do at this point. This is... I don't have a very good deck right now. I'm, I got so used to my old deck. I miss it. I, I want those cards. But see, I didn't even get, like, my, my self card back. I don't... I'm pretty sure I don't have my self card in my deck. I got that last time. Maybe I just die on purpose so I can make a death card again. Oh, but I don't have anything good yet. No, I need to go for at least a little bit to get something good <laughs> yeah okay literally this is the buying time strategy i can win this fight i can win this fight now by just stalling it out it's just gonna take a while so Oh, no, I've only got a few squirrels left. Maybe not. Oh, no, no. <laughs> I see the way this is going. I concede. Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you so much for not putting us through that. Thank you. You're welcome. You may accept my surrender. Or you may finish this match the slow way. No, I accept the surrender. Thank you. I'm, I can't be bothered. <laughs> It's okay, he just recognizes a winner when he sees one. He. <laughs> right, what is this? Can I get gold? You come across a hobbled man standing beside some boulders. You caught me off guard! Not supposed to see me till further down the road, yes, yeah, is the prospector. Hi. Say, I like me a gamble. If when you can pick a boulder that has gold in it, you can keep it. Um, okay. Show me where to strike. Oh. Hmm. They all look the same to me. Hmm. But these ones have like one dot here. This one has like two. Oh, then this one has like some dots down here. This one has one. This one's faded. Hmm. I'm gonna go for the middle one. <gasps> hey! Hee-haw! It is gold! A golden pelt. I can bail you by giving it to you. But a promise is a promise where I'm from. Thank you. Thank you for my pelt. I appreciate it. Now let me get, like, a single item, because I have a hook and a special dagger. Ugh, I, don't, I don't care about any of these. Let's get a boulder, why not? <laughs> More rocks. Right, what is further up ahead? This has a- ooh. Hmm. I think I'm actually gonna go this way because I I want to I want to go to the campsite and like see if I can buff my squirrels. I don't think it'll let me. I don't know if it will let me. I don't remember seeing the squirrels before, but if I can like buff my squirrels at the campsite, that would be really really funny. <laughs> so I'm gonna go that way. Yep. My lucky draw again. Thank you very much. There's a wolf cub. Hmm. 
Hmm. Do I start with my stoat? Yeah, I think I will. Hey, stoat, I'm putting you on the board with the intention of maybe staying alive this time. <laughs> yep. Oh, whoa, you, you actually said something in the affirmative this time. Hi. A good choice? Stop doing that. Ding. Stop that. Don't worry, they will stop it soon enough. Boop. Gardener the squirrel, but I've also got a bullfrog. Okay, yeah, stoat may be in trouble. <laughs> Oopsie. That's okay. Let's just have a frog over on this side. Why not? It's okay, stoat. I believe in you. You can, you can survive this, right? You can tank this, right? Not a problem. <laughs> Goodbye. I'll miss you. <laughs> Alright, well, what I'm gonna do now... Is... <laughs> <laughs> and yeah, I, I can take one damage from the wolf cub. They'll, they'll even each other out. That's fine. Okay. And from here, mantis. Oh, perfect. Perfect, perfect. Yes. Mantis goes here. Hits them both. Wolf won't die immediately, but the wolf is distracted by this massive boulder. So it's fine. Yeah, look at that. And then distraction squirrel, and I win. Oh, I didn't even need distraction squirrel. The wolf's about to die. <laughs> like that, there we go. Nice. Didn't get any excess teeth. That's okay. Cards. Ba -ba -ba. Whoa. Mm. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I'm so sorry, everybody. I need to. F I need to figure out what this says now. I simply must. I. I cannot continue without figuring out what this says. <laughs> Uh. Right, let me... Uh, I can't scan it with my phone, it's saying no text found. But that's okay. Let me get my tiny notepad out. Bam 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 bam. O one one o o one o o o one one o o one o one o one one o o one o one o one 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 o o o o o one one o o o one o o one one o o one o one o one one o one 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 o o one one o o one o one o one one o o o o one o one 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 o one o o Oh one one oh one oh oh oh, I got him! I got him! Now find a binary translator. It says deep beneath. <laughs> oh God! Okay. <laughs> okay. Um. Yep. Yeah, that says deep beneath. Is there going to be another line? No. It just says deep beneath. That's, hmm. Alpha? The venerable Alpha. Its courage emboldens the creatures that stand beside it. Ooh. And a cockroach. Cockroach is fun. I am so curious about this. I am deep beneath. Maybe I'll get my um, creepy tentacle card back. I'm gonna pick it. 
That's my card now. Um, <laughs> I wonder what'll happen when I play that. Uh, we will we'll find out. Anyway, I want to go to camp. Hello! Warm a creature by the fire, enhance its health, said a hungry survivor. Oh, I wanted the, the damage up ones. I wanted to enhance damage, but having health up feels like a positive. Hmm. What do I want to have more health? I'm, I I keep drawing the mantis cards. But uh, part of me is like, if if I buff Stinkbug a bunch, then like the Stinky can be really helpful. You'll be fine because you're Stinky, right? The firebug warmed the weary stink bug and enhanced its health. You suspected the intentions of the survivors were less than pure. With your stink bug in tow, you retreated into the woods. It's, it's getting ominous, more ominous each time. All right, am I ready for the prospective fight? I don't think I am. Let's go. Yeah. How can anyone not choose the static card? Oh, right! Isn't it cool? Whoa! Huh? That's smoke. It is great indeed. I've got greater smoke. Whoa, look at this smoke. This smoke attacks. <laughs> Yo, okay. I'll take that. Oh, here we go. Yep. A chill mist closed in around you. You are not alone. A figure emerged from the fog. Uh, I'm so sick of this boss. <laughs> this is so interesting. Stand in the way of me gold, be darned. Well, I got a rock on my board. Whoa, whoa. It became an elk. Okay. All right became an elk. Oh, the pack mule. I want to get the pack mule. <laughs> oh, but is the pack mule even worth it? I've, I've got so much item space just taken up. Uh. Coyote will move down and attack for two. Let's sacrifice a squirrel to the coyote so we don't take direct damage. And then, honestly, I'm feeling uh, greater smoke. Just, like, stick it in the corner. Let it just... Oh, maybe, like, here. Let's do it. Give it a bash. See what happens. So I'll do one damage right off the bat. Or I could sacrifice it and bring out the mantis. <laughs> that could also be pretty good, because then I'll get two hits. I think I do that, actually. I want the mantis here. And I got loads of bones! Okay. Boop, boop. Oh, it's like every time the pack mule moves, it gets an item, I guess, or a card. Interesting. Oh, the coyote's coming down there. Oh, that will kill my mantis in a second. So that's not so great, but I'll still deal another damage before it gets to that. Oh, unless I... <laughs> unless I just swap it out for a... for an elk. You know what? Oh, yeah, it's all going to turn to gold in a second, but, um... No, I don't actually want to do that. The squirrel's just going to tank the hit. Boop. Yep, that's okay. 
that's all right. Let's see if I can get something else. Oh, mantas. Yep. Let's go for that. I'll do one damage and then it'll be the next round, I think. Oh no, got one more round. One more round. This will be the one where I win. Oh, unless... Oh, wait, no, actually... <laughs> I've still got the elk in my hand, which is pretty decent. I'm gonna do this. I wanna get the pack mule. <laughs> see if this works. Okay, moved over to that side. Let's get a squirrel in preparation for the next round, which is about to start. Yeah, I'm just going to go for it. All right, turn my wolf and boulder into gold. Go for it. Yep. Yep. You've struck gold, you have indeedy. Oh, and there's that little awful thing. It just pops up to take the attack in an empty space, but that's not a problem if I do this. And I do this. And I do this. And I do that. And then I destroy the pack mule. <laughs> like that. Gimme. Gimme, gimme, what I get? Whoa! Dang, nab it! Get him! Okay, okay. I got. Oh! Whoa, wait, what is that? Bell ring? What is bell ringing? Being represented by this. Oh, is it gonna be like the power is increased by how many bells are ringing? Does the sound of the mining count as bells? I haven't set any bells ringing yet. Hmm. Well, that's nice at least. Oh, I can summon the turkey vulture. Oh, but the bloodhound's gonna pop up as soon as I place. Unless I place it behind the coyote, but then it'll hit it for two. No, but I'll still hit for three. No, I just think, I think I just win. What's the score like? Yeah, it's completely balanced. I think I just win if I play this. Oh no, I have to, <laughs> I have to actually draw all of this. <laughs> I forgot that I hadn't drawn a card because I have so many. Yeah, if I just play this here, I think I just, I just win, right? Two and three. play this one though. Ah, oh. That's fine. Let's, let's just do it. Let me win. There we go. That was easy. I'm getting the hang of this now. I don't know if that card doesn't really ring a bell. Hi, Autumn. <laughs> You'll not perish quite yet. No, I'm good. I'm, I'm, I don't plan on perishing. Thank you. Perhaps one of these will entice you. All right. Mantis God! Long Elk! Huh? What? No! Why? Why? I have no words for this freak of nature. Why? I have to pick it, don't I? I'm <laughs> Wait, and there's the Uriuli again. I have to. What is this? I have to. It's got the, the instant death. <laughs> oh, I, I don't like that. I really don't like that. I'm taking it. <laughs> oh, that's horrible. Most box, hello. Welcome, welcome. Welcome on in. I just got a long elk. Hi. Free of the prospector's unhinged gaze, you looked ahead. 
into the wetlands. We will need another map. Yep. As the air grew humid, your boots became harder to pull from the mud. The dank smell of tepid water invaded your nostrils. You had reached the wetlands. A little nastier than last time, I think. Hmm. Which way do I want to go? I... Oh. You know what? I've... Oh, but campfire. I'm going to risk it. I feel like the more I go to the campfires, the worse it's going to be. But I want to try. <laughs> All right. Oh, there's a mole. There's a mole. That oh, whoa, ringworm. The underappreciated ringworm. Its value is not readily apparent. And a bullfrog. The fact that it says its use is not readily apparent makes me want to take it because it's going to have a use. Like, I'm <laughs> hearing that, I'm just like, this is going to have a use, isn't it? I don't really care about the mole and bullfrog too much. I, <laughs> This might be the worst decision because it doesn't look good. But who cares? <laughs> Campfire. The crackling fire lit the starving faces of a group of survivors. We have not food, one said. But perhaps one of your creatures will join us, enhance its power, said another. Oh, it's another power one. I mean, how could I not get the worm? Exactly, I, I need the worm. <laughs> hmm. Why, wait, they've all got spears now. They all have spears and they just said they don't have food. I think I made a mistake. Can I go back? <laughs> I think I made a mistake. This, this doesn't feel good. Doesn't feel good. <laughs> I've just had a <laughs> I've just had a really silly idea. <laughs> what if they're actually gonna eat whatever I place down? What if I make them eat a ring? <laughs> I've got a really bad feeling about this. I'm <laughs> What if, uh, like, having, having, like, extra damage for the ringworm could be good. Like, what if I end up, like, buffing the ringworm? And then it turns out later on I get, like, the worm god or something that buffs all worms. Yeah! The fire warmed the weary ringworm and enhanced its power. You suspected the intentions of the survivors were less than pure. With your ringworm in tow, you retreated into the woods. Nice! I was suspicious for no reason. Wait, oh my god, wait, I just realized. Oh my god, at the very end. At the very end, it was like, if you have a ring, you can pass. Oh. Oh, what if that's what the ring worms for? Oh, I'm glad I picked that up. Oh. Oh, I bet it is. Because I the, the icon on the boon thing looked funky. It didn't look like a regular ring. It looked like something wrapped around a finger. Oh, that's disgusting if that is what it actually is. I hope it is. Oh, I hope it is. I hope it is. I'll be like, yeah, I got a ring. Look at this. <laughs> oh, I have a beaver! Hi! Got a beaver this time. The Lord of the Ringworms. <laughs> Wait, yeah, worm on a ring? <laughs> oh my goodness, it all makes sense. It all makes sense. Right, yeah, there's the bullfrog that's gonna just keep directly attacking me, but that's okay if I can draw a mantis. Which I can't do yet. Because I don't have much. 
Yeah, I'm just gonna take one damage from the bullfrog, whatever I do, so... Oh, you know what? Let's get the ringworm out. Why not? Let's, let's, let's get the ringworm out. Do a little bit of direct damage. Why not? There we go. <laughs> it's not a pleasant looking beaver. What are you talking about? Got the, the logs and everything. Got the teeth chomping. This is a powerful beaver. All right. There we go. And you're going to damage... Oh, no, no. That's the one that blocks direct damage. I, I got him the wrong way around. Oh, now there's an adder that's going to kill my ringworm. No. I made a mistake. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Hello. <laughs> Susan May, hi. Thank you for the raid. Welcome in, raiders. How's it going? I hope you had fun with the the potion making. <laughs> Welcome on in. Oh my goodness, thank you for the hydrate and posture check. I will have a sip of my drink. And a big stretch. Oh, sit up straight. But uh, welcome in, welcome in, raiders. I totally haven't been here for ages. No, I haven't seen you in chat at all. It's, it is a mystery. <laughs> But thank you for bringing the raid this way. Welcome in. To anyone who's new here, hello. I'm Liri, a not-so-pink-haired cat girl from the UK. I usually am pink-haired. And I love comfy games and puzzle games. And there's a lot of puzzling in this game. It is the opposite of comfy. But it's incredible. I love this game. This is so, so interesting. I, I can't wait to see how deep it goes. I feel like there's just going to keep being like more and more levels to it. And I love that. But yes, thank you for the raid. I, I really appreciate it. I've made mistakes in this battle. I've made many mistakes. I just need a mantis. Oh, then the mantis is going to die to the adders anyway. There's just loads of snakes approaching me. <laughs> uh, I guess I can get a beaver. But the beaver will just die. Oh, I guess I can put the beaver here and start attacking this stump, and then the beaver will put a dam down here, so I won't take any damage. Because the ringworm is going to die anyway. I'll, I'll take, like, one damage from it, but I'm, I'm okay with that. Let's do it. I want the beaver. We got a dam! A formidable defense! Uh, I would ask if I have any short horror game suggestions because you don't know what to do tomorrow. Oh, I don't really like play much horror, but uh, I have played a few before. I I try to do it like every October. I try and check out some interesting looking horror games that I've played. Uh, it depends on what like flavor of horror you're looking for. But uh, I, I might have suggestions possibly. Right, yeah, I'm, I'm gonna take damage from that adder. But then the other one's being blocked by this dam for now, so at least I'll only take one damage. All these adders. Yeah, I can't really do anything here. I need to pick a creature and hope I... Ugh. Not you, I didn't want you. I was gonna say hope that I get one that I can summon with bones. But I can't do that. I'm just gonna... The adders are just gonna hit them. Does the pelt get destroyed if I place it and it dies? I feel like the fact that it's a pelt, like the item things, probably would. I think the items are like, once they die, they're gone. But I'm not sure. I'm not gonna risk it. I don't want to put the pelt down. You know what? I'll just eat the damage. It's okay. I'll eat the damage. Oop. Ouch. Owie. Come on. Stink bug! Yeah, stink bug can take out the adder. And then start attacking. Cracking! I'm just gonna take damage from these, but it's, it's okay. That's another two damage though. Oh, they're doing so much damage. Oh. Might just lose this. 
Oh no, actually, no. What I'm gonna do is, um, beaver. The beaver was cool. I'm gonna take out the adder instead. <laughs> and I'll only take one damage from that, so th th this is recoverable. I can get back from this. It's not great. But I can get back from this. I think what I do is I just keep drawing squirrels to block this path with the bullfrog. And then Stinkbug and Stoat can just attack. <laughs> That's my current plan. And we'll see if it works. Boop boop. Killed squirrel. Okay. Let me put another squirrel there. <laughs> Let's see if he ends up doing another, like, oh, another stalemate. Ugh. Oh, gotta head out to eat. Oh, that is fine. I hope you get nice food. Thank you for the luck. I, I feel like I need it. <laughs> You'll try anything. Uh, well, I, um, one thing I do remember enjoying was, like, the first year I did streaming, um, I, I had, like, a horror week where I was playing games that I wouldn't usually play. Um, one of the games I played then was Pony Island, which is the same developer as Inscription. It's uh, Daniel Mullen's game. And that was incredible. And I also played Layers of Fear. I don't know if you've played Layers of Fear or not, but the, it was an entertaining stream. <laughs> I had fun playing it. And uh, also, if you want like Yuri Visual novels and stuff too, the, I don't know if you've played uh, Who is the Red Queen, but that is a really, really good game. I don't know if you've already played it or not. You may have already tried it, but if you haven't, it's a good game and it's free and it's gay. <laughs> Right, yep, continue, do the same thing again. Oh, you're bringing in a, 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 a frog. Bringing in a frog to change the, the stakes a little bit. It's not gonna make a difference. I'm still doing the exact same thing. It's still fine. <laughs> it's just a little slower now, but I'm still gonna win. Oh, it broke that though. Oh no, it's yeah, it's fine. I still win. <laughs> no, yeah, I just win. That's fine. Got him. I'm not getting any extra teeth this time around, but I don't care. Wait, before I visit the trapper, let me let me just see like if there's any. Oh yeah, I can. <gasps> Yoink mine my teeth now. Preparing. I'm glad I checked. <laughs> yeah, oh, you've played all of the Elan games except for On Wings, Bringing Sleep. Oh, that's a that could actually be a good one, though. As well. Like, it's... I, I feel like horror is maybe the wrong word, but it's like a dark, dark story for On Wings, Bringing Sleep. So it could thematically fit. Boom. Right, I want to I wanna buy pelts. Hi. I'll be clear with you. The trapping business been lagging. After being defeated by that challenger, who, who's that? Well, I'm thinking of clearing me inventory, trying something else. Like what? Pelts are cheaper now. Oh, okay. First one's free. Oh, thank you. Much appreciated. Yeah, I'll take that for free. Thank you. Blup. Sacrifice. <laughs> what would happen if I sacrificed the, the static card? <laughs> Ooh. I am so tempted. I'm so tempted, but I also kind of just want to keep it. Oh, I'm really tempted. You know what? Why not? Why not? I am here to try things. I got a boon. A bone boon. Boon bone? Is that the one that gives me a bone every turn? I'll take it. Probably wasn't worth the, the static sacrifice. That's okay. Lucky draw, yes! I, I'm so happy! 
I'm so happy. Stink bug. Right. Oh, this is the bees. This is the bees. Okay. All right. How am I taking out the bees? I know how I'm going to take out the bees. I'm going to do this. And then I'm going to do this. There you go, masterful. Thank you. See, it, the stink bug is so lovely to me. Stink bug supports my decisions and believes in me to do a good job. Boop, boop. And that bee now has no power because smelly. <laughs> nice. There's a mantis. Mantis would be good to have out when I can next sacrifice something. Oh, wait, actually, no, I'm going to sacrifice the bullfrog. Stick the mantis here. Mantis can hit both these directions. Yeah. That'll do. It'll still attack for this turn, but that's fine. I'll hit it next time. And now that side also has a mantis, but that's okay. I don't care. I got the pelt. Of course I did. Oh, you you own it on Epic. <laughs> oh yeah, if if you're ever stuck on ideas for games to play and you like pick up the free games on Epic pretty frequently, just check through your whole Epic Games library. <laughs> I just pick up every single game that's available for free, and half the time I don't even look at what it is properly. But I've gotten some really good games through that. Like I discovered Filament through that. Like, I think, well, I think Barb mentioned it to me, and then I got it free on Epic, and I was like, well, I, yeah, I can play that. Right, well, yeah, the, the mantis is just going to kill the bee, but then the mantis, this mantis is going to go forward and hit these two, so that's not great. No, I think it's actually time to take the, the mantis out. Yeah. Sacrifice mantis. Ringworm, kill the bee. Yes. Yes. Now the mantis goes down, and it will direct hit me. But it's okay. Because it will die to the ringworm next turn. We're fine. Oh, it's a beehive! Don't want that. Yeah, there's nothing I can do about this bee right now. But it's okay. I just need to not hit that beehive and I'll be okay. Yeah, I'll only take one damage. It'll be okay. It's okay. Because I deal the direct damage and then I take a direct damage. That's okay. It is all right. Oh, I'm picking... Oh, I'm grabbing all the pelts now. Ah, I guess this is like the downside of having all of the pelts in your deck. Like, you can just randomly draw them in fights, and then it's like, well, I have a handful of pelts. This this is great. Do I sacrifice a squirrel? No, no, they're like direct hits. It won't make a difference. I'll, I'll hit directly for two, but then I'm going to be hit for three. So there's nothing I can do at the moment. I just need to pray I get something good next turn. That's all I can do. Oh, no, stink bugs, stop that one attacking. Okay, we're okay. That was even. We evened it out. It's okay. And the ringworm will kill the bee, but then the ant will kill the ringworm. Which isn't so great. Oh, unless I get a wolf out. Unless I get the wolf out. Yeah. Get the wolf out. <laughs> Wolf goes here, it'll kill everything in this aisle. Because one and two, three health. Oh, three damage even. Wolf takes care of that. And then I'm only taking the damage from this one. And then the next turn, I've got free reign to smack. <laughs> nice. Nice. Boop. Oh. Oh, hello. 
Oh, I see the long elk's face now. Hi. Hello. Wow, you are so... You're so long. <laughs> you are so very long, aren't you? I guess you can kill that bee. <laughs> yeah, you know what? You can kill that bee. That's okay. You kill that bee. This is great. Okay. Oh, it wiggled. Why do you, why do you wiggle? Why did it wiggle? Why did it wiggle? Oh, because it couldn't move. Oh, okay. No. <laughs> Never mind. Just having a, a mild heart attack, thinking that the, the elk is going to come out of the card and eat me. It's because it couldn't do the effect because there's stuff in the way. It's fine. There's a, there's a reason for it. <laughs> and now I should get so much overkill. Yeah, I'm going to get four extra teeth from this. Nice. Lovely. Delicious. Yeah, it did. The the elk just looked like it was like staring into my soul. That was terrifying. <laughs> I wasn't ready for that. I was just expecting the spine again. Right, cards. What is the mushroom? Right, that is uh, the diligent ant. Its strength is proportional to the size of its colony. And a river otter and a sparrow. Hmm. I don't know what to go for. You know what? I'm going to go for the sparrow because, like, the airborne is really handy. What is this? It's like a mushroom. What's the mushroom? Whoa! You found yourself among a grove of thick and pungent mushrooms. Delightful. Didn't even know it was a spine the first time. I didn't know until I saw the head attached to it, to be honest. I was trying to figure out what it was. I was like, it's it's something long. But yeah. You squinted to see a figure through a thick cloud of spores. Whoa, hello. We are the mycologists, yes? There's another there's another mask, there's another character. Hi. Yes. Oh this oh. Am I gonna, like, have some, like, parasitic addition to a card? That sounds cool. A and we are performing our experiments far from... from... We are not welcome elsewhere. I can't imagine why. We will experiment on your flock, yes? We... we will need two of the same creatures. I've got two mantas! One for each of us. I've got two mantas. You want to experiment on the mantis? You're okay with that, right? The uh, little little buddies. You're, you're you like mushrooms, right? This this will be safe, right? I'm sure this is fine. I'm sure this is not a problem. Oh, I I think this could. Get, what are you doing? What have I done? Look away. What have I done? <laughs> what did I do? No! What did I do? The, the mantis it is now won? It just it just buffed it. It but it's oh Oh wow. Okay, but at what cost? Whoa. Oh boy. It's okay, Mantis love to dismember each other, right? Right! <laughs> okay, this is my incredible deck. I've got two pelts, a long elk, a ringworm, a sparrow, two mantises that have been stuck together to make one, good old stink bug, stink bug and stoat, a wolf and a bullfrog. This, this is great. Wonderful. It's fantastic. I want to go this way. So I can get to this one. I want to go here. <laughs> so we're going to do the totem fight. Oh, I wish I hadn't made my totem what I did. I, I really messed up with the squirrels. It's okay. Oh, what is that? What are these birds doing? What are the birds doing? When I'm posing up. Oh, yep, the, the, the birds will just pop up wherever there's wherever I place something. 
Okay, so if I place something down now, the Kingfisher will pop up in front of it. That's actually bad. That's actually really bad, right? Because that usually just, like, sinks below and then attacks from nowhere and then sinks again. If I just play any creature, then it'll pop up in front of it and I can just attack it. That's so funny. That is really funny. That's really, really funny. This is great. <laughs> That's so silly. What a silly thing to do. Like if I play the bullfrog here. Oh no, is that not how it works? Oh, I guess because it's not in play yet. That's all right. But uh, well, I'm, I'm blocking the airborne attacks now with my bullfrog. So um, whatever, do what you want. The attacks are being blocked. Hi. It looks like it's biting something. Like, what are you? What are you biting? What have you got in your mouth, elk? Uh, drop it. <laughs> no, drop it. What do you got? Drop it. No. Okay. Right. Well, I I think the mantis can be helpful here as well. But uh, let's start with that, I guess. And a boop. Yeah, that, oh, that's, that did hurt a bit. Oh no, this, this was actually really bad. Huh. Oh, this is really bad. Oh no. Oh no, I made big mistake. I made a huge mistake. Oh, I might not survive. <laughs> oh no. Oh dear. Oh, it's yeah, it's where the heart icon is. I see. Oh, that's that's so funny. <laughs> it's like biting the heart. Oh, thank you for the head pat too. I, I feel like I need all the head pats at the moment. This is terrifying. I I think I've made big mistakes. And I'm trying to figure out how I can make this work. I guess like that's going to attack in the air anyway. Maybe I put the mantis down here so I can at least take out the coyote. That might be the play. Hold on, let's see what happens if I do that. Okay, because it's flipped over, it doesn't, like, jump over. Right, well, I'm, I think I am. I'm going to go with taking out the coyote. And I will also hit for two direct damage, so that'll cancel out the two damage the bat will do me. And the sparrow's not in play because of this horrible little creature. So I think I'm okay. I think I'm okay. I think I'm okay. Yeah, I'm okay. No, it... it Okay, never mind. I'm not okay. I will just do four damage in the next turn, though, which is very nice. Oh, how many bones? Oh, no, I can bring the elk in. Oh, no, I did, I did this badly. <laughs> you again. Yeah, I'm not putting you out. Sorry. Uh, I take two damage, and then I'll take the damage from that, too. Ah. How much damage did that one do? I think it's going to just even out again. I'm going to try. I'm going to try. Four damage. And then... Okay, it's only a one. So four damage again. Yeah, evened it out. Okay. Oh, the, oh I forgot they... Oh, I hate these things. Hate these. I hate them. I hate these ones so much. Why do they go underwater? Despise them. Give me something good. Stink bug. Yeah, stink bug. You can lower the power so they don't do any damage. Yeah. Yeah, let's put you here. I love you, stink bug. Stink bug is lovely. This isn't great. 
Whoa. Hold on a second. Something just popped up, like, on my computer. Like, an auto-updater thingy that just terrified the life out of me. <laughs> like, the second it hit midnight, it was just like, Oh, your computer auto-updating? I'm, like, I'm so on edge with this game. That that happening, like, just... I, I don't know what just happened. I, what happened in that turn? Am I alive? I'm still kind of alive. It's not looking good. In fact, it's looking incredibly terrible and bad in every kind of way. I think I may be screwed. I'm very much in trouble. No, but I do direct damage when there's like when they're like underwater, right? So maybe I do get the stoat out. Maybe I get the stoat out. So I can kill the coyote. Get the stoat out. I have three out of four bones. So close. Just like, so long as I don't die is the thing. Like, I'll do two damage. Three, four direct damage. And I'll take two, three, four. Five. I'll take five. I can still survive that, right? I think. I can survive it. Barely. Come on. Yes. No, because I killed the one in the back, too. Oh, okay, okay. I'm, I'm bringing it back. <laughs> Somehow, kind of. Kind of slightly. <laughs> you know what? Let's stick a squirrel here and get a bone to get my long elk. <laughs> I think this might be okay. I might win. I'm, oh, I might just win. I might just win. Do I win? Yes! Oh! Did you see how many teeth were in play there? That was... Oh. Oh, goodness. Um, I'm gonna go this way. <laughs> I want this. I want this. I wanna get to here. I wanna go here. So let's see. Let's see what cards are available. There's... Oh, Alpha? Cockroach? Or River Snapper? Ooh. Ooh, I... Oh! Hold on. I can use my squirrels with this. I can use my squirrels with this. I can use my squirrels. I can give my squirrels a power with this. <laughs> okay. All right, what sigils am I passing on? Oh. Okay. Oh, do I give the... I'm not really using the sparrow. I think I'm giving the airborne sigil to something else. What's what's going to be airborne? <laughs> airborne ringworm. That's horrifying. Oh, the mantis. Oh. If I made the, the mantis airborne and it didn't get blocked, it would just do four direct health damage every turn. That sounds wild. I am so tempted. I'm gonna do it. We got a flying mantis. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna do it. Flying mantis time. Oop, and it's time for the angler. I'm I'm really not ready for this. I'm I'm not ready. Ugh. Oh, but at least I, I have the hook. I have the hook, I have my greater smoke. The mud tugged hard at your feet, forcing you to slow your pace. A rank odour caused your stomach to churn and your eyes to water. It was the rotting fish that hung from the branches around you. A huge man approached. Hi. 
Go fish. Okay. Hi. <laughs> you again. God, I got two pelts in my initial hand. That's so bad. That's awful. That's just... It's just really bad. Right, you're you're really annoying, so I want to, like, grab this one with my hook, maybe. But I also want to save it. Yeah, this is, like, a, a terrible starting point. <laughs> uh, I guess I could put the smoke down and just... I don't know where, I'll just... There. Right in the middle. You can do a direct damage for two turns. And... I kind of want to save the squirrel for a little bit. Keep it in my hand. Let's just see how this goes. First round. It's going to be like completely even. Yep. And of course there's another kingfisher back there. All stale. Hard choose. I don't want you to have the greater smoke. You know what? End of my round, I'm going to place a rabbit pelt down <laughs> and see if it pulls the pelt. Because first I want to get a bullfrog in here. Start doing a little bit of damage. Put you there. Take new fish. Easy. No thank you. Sacrifice you put a bullfrog there. Fresh. Choose. Now, what if I put this rabbit pelt there? You want that, don't you? Yeah, you really want that. Yes, perfect. Yes, that's... I mean, I mean, oh no, don't don't pull my rabbit pelt back and um, block your annoying card off. That, that would be awful. <laughs> I sure would hate that. Right, yeah, that's just going to attack, but that's okay. Oh, I should have put the bullfrog there. That's all right. Alright. Hey! Nice! Go fish! There you go, you've just blocked your own card off. I hope you have fun. <laughs> okay, bullfrog will die eventually if I leave it here. So let's see if I can get anything better to replace it with. <laughs> oh yeah, I can! Yeah, I... Yeah. Mantis. I think this is fine. Try that. Do a bunch of damage. Okay, won this round. Die already! <laughs> Whoa! Calm down, buddy. This is a video game. Go fish. Yeah, there's the bait. Oh, sadly, my mantis is... Oh, no! My mantis is... Um... I'm so glad I have the flying mantis. It's going to miss the bait buckets. I think I can literally just win. Oh, hold on. I, th I think I, I just win. Sacrifice that, and then I'll put it, like, to the side. And I'll just do, like, five direct damage and win? I just whip? No, I didn't. No, I didn't attack the bait bucket. Yes! I did not take the bait. Didn't take the bait. Reignite. Yeah, give me that back. I didn't even use the hook, too. Perhaps one of these will entice you? That went so well. Mantis God. Child 13. Mole Man! Ooh, the mole man was really annoying before when it was used against me. Hmm. Could be good. I also like the thought of the child 13 and having the... When the card's sacrificed, it doesn't perish. Like, getting, like, the multi-sacrifices. I've not really been using that. That could be really handy. I do just like Mantis God. Oh, I think especially because I've got, like, my souped-up Mantis as well. It is time. Yeah, always big mantis god. <laughs> Thanks for the commentary. Moving past the pond, you took a deep breath of fresh air and continued on. 
a moment. Oh, yep, new map, thank you. The relief of the fresh air quickly gave way to a bone-shaking chill. You guessed at the path ahead as the snow increasingly obscured it. You had climbed to the snow line. God, I feel like I'm missing something here. I'm just doing like the exact same things again, but I don't have like, I don't have a film reel or anything. Oh, let me take those, thank you. I don't know where I can get like film from. The only thing I can think is like in this clock. I don't know what time it is. Oh, I wonder if I can like, can I take my card? Oh, I wonder if I could if I had like the pliers or something. Or like this. Something to like pry it out with. Pry out the nail and then I can just take the card. Boop, 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 boop. No, they're, they're just there having a good time now. Squirrel and coyote. I want it. Can I just... No, oh, I miss my old card. I can't believe he took it from me. It's so mean. All right. Time to continue. <gasps> Hold on a second. Who's this? I got Kaminsky. See, I feel like Kaminsky's not actually very good because Kaminsky will just pop up and then die. But maybe I, maybe that means I can get myself. Maybe that means I can get myself back at some point. I want myself back, please. I want, I want the Leary. <sighs> you know what? This moose buck was so good before. I'm getting the moose buck again. Apparently, I'm going for like um, a, a moose and mantis deck at the moment. <laughs> Yeah, I'm, I'm going like moose and mantis with like the long elk and the moose and the, the mantis and the mantis god. <laughs> ha. Nice. Right, which path do I want to take? Hmm. Oh, I want to add more sigils to other cards. I, I think I want to take this path purely for that reason. Yeah, I'm, I'm taking this path purely for that reason. I just want to like fully sigil buff all of my cards because then when I get a cave thing, I can go wisdom and get like a guaranteed win. Ah, <sighs> what do I do? What am I giving to what? Hmm, I think what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna do the bullfrog. And give this skill to the stoat instead, because stoat has more health. And can tank the hits a bit better. Oh, this wolf. Oh, no, I'll do stoat. Here you go. You want to you wanna get some power? Here you go. A gift for you. And pelts, unfortunately. <laughs> the, the pelts are just... Uh... Right. Encounter, let's see what we got. Give me a bone for my bone boon. I, I really wish I'd done a different totem. Okay, I got mantis god. I got mantis. I got long elk. And a squirrel. There's a moose buck and a mole. No! I don't want the moose buck. Ah. Hold on, I can literally just do four damage in one turn. <laughs> Hold on. Hold on, I think I'm fine. I think I'm fine. I think I can win this quite quickly. Watch this. Watch this. Check this out. Boop, boop. A little bit, but that's fine. 
Because I'm about to do four direct damage. Hmm. Am I? Yeah, I can only do four like that. Hold on. What if I do this? A ringworm, why? Yeah, four's all I need. No, yeah, I just win. It's fine. I, um, I simply choose to win. Thank you very much. <laughs> Easy! Oh, I like that. I like this mantis. I'm, I'm happy with this mantis now. This is good. Hello! Your pelt's clean! Um, maybe the, the rabbit one might be a little bit scuffed, but don't worry about it. Hair pelts. I, oh, I want this again. I don't know what the bell thing does. I haven't got any bells ringing at the moment. Is that a, a, a golden pelt? Magnificent. I could get the amoeba. I could get the amoeba or I could get the pack rat and then stick the item thing on something else. Ah. <laughs> uh. Ah. Oh, I'm so tempted by the amoeba. I'm doing it. I'm I'm going to do it. I'm doing it. You have my gratitude. Thank you for taking my pelts. Right. Which ah, oh, which way should I go? I'll go this way. Because I want to fix this this horrible totem. I made mistakes. Ah, uh, she moved with a certain vigor in spite of her considerable age. Oh. Oh. Fledgling power up could be so good. Cause like this already has the poison, so it wouldn't be like the the most super useful thing. But power it up. I am here for that. I wanna try that. My new totem. My new totem. I'm, I no longer have the useless squirrel one that I messed up on. You hunched down to place her offering in your pack. When you looked up again, the ancient woman had yes! vanished. Oh my god! I got it. I fixed my totem. My tel my totem. My totem. My totem. <laughs> I don't even know what I tried to say there. That was weird. And does the long elk get longer? Oh, I hope so. I hope so. Be like longer elk. Also, welcome back! Welcome back! I hope you had good food. Let's do this encounter. Bone. Right, two elks on that side. Don't like them, I want to take them out. Bleh, stop that. Right, what shall I use to take them out? They only have, like, one attack. Hmm. I, don't, I can't really do much with this hand I got. This isn't a great hand. Right, I'm going to place down a squirrel just to block, like, one attack. So I only take one damage. But there's, there's not much I can do. I can at least get a bone from this, I guess. This is not a good start. Oh, there's so many things! What are you doing? What are they doing? There's a, a mole there, there's an elk there. Flah. Amoeba! <gasps> I can bring the amoeba in though. Yeah. Yeah. Bring in the amoeba and I will kill that elk. This one will evolve, but I think it will get in the way of this elk so this one can't move forward, so it... Might be okay. 
yeah, I'm really not in a good spot. No, it just evolved immediately. Never mind. I lost. Okay. Got a candle gone. That's not great. When will a worthy challenger appear? Look, I'm sorry. Sorry. All right, what do we got? Black goat. The, perni the pernicious vulture, a tyrant of the skies. And the mighty, the flighty elk. It moves after attacking. I think I want an elk. With what? I no, do I want the black goat? I got the, the what? The ba ba The moose bug. I think I want the black goat. <laughs> oh, do I? Do I go to the campsite again? I. I'm gonna try the campsite again. I wanna see if it changes. Okay, they've got like little like, I don't even know what this is. It's like, oh, I guess it's like, it depends on what the buff is. Like if it's the health one, it's this. If it's the attack buff, they have like the spears. That makes sense. It's like protection, like little umbrellas. Warm a creature by the fire, enhance its health, said a hungry survivor. Right, what do I wanna buff the health of? What should have more health? Maybe long elk. <laughs> Maybe I make long elk have more health. That feels like it would be good. Long elk, more health. The fire warmed the weary long elk and embraced, enhanced its health. You suspected the intentions of the survivors were less than pure. With your long elk in tow, you retreated into the woods. Yeah. My elk. Also, Akninarith, hello, welcome. That time of year and a uh, spoopy card game is making runs again. Oh, I'm, I'm really excited to be playing this. Like this game is so fun. Like I, I purposely have avoided like as much information about this game as I could. And I didn't really get spoiled for anything apart from the fact that it's a card game. <laughs> and that it gets weird. And I am, oh, I'm having such a blast with it. It's incredible. I, I feel like I'm not doing things right at the moment, but it's okay. I'm just going to keep going until I cannot go anymore. And, oh, I'm having such a blast. It's so good. All right, let's try and not die. <laughs> right, this one has a boulder. Oh, and, um, oh, raven eggs and an elk fawn. Everything's going to evolve. Do you have mantis god? Do you have a wolf? The wolf could be good to play. I don't have enough to sacrifice for the wolf. Oh, mantis god, I can do like two damage in the first turn. I guess. Yeah, you know what I'm gonna do? I will do this. Mantis God go here, hiding behind the boulder. It will attack the boulder a little bit, but it'll also hit that way. Like that. And they'll move forward before they evolve. So I think I'll only take one damage. Yeah. Yeah, they haven't evolved yet and the boulder's in the way. So that elk fawn cannot, cannot move and I'm about to kill it. <laughs> so now I will get squirrel out. Yeah, we'll get stoat. Stoat can finish off this raven egg. We'll attack it with the mantis god and stoat and the raven egg will die before it evolves. And we'll also kill the elk fawn Oh, then the porcupine will move forward. That's fine. This is probably fine. I hit a lot of things. I also got hit, which isn't as great, but it's okay. Right. Oh. 
Oh, I should have had this, like... No, like, whichever one I went for, it would happen, but... This sparrow will move forward, and it can't attack me directly because of the stoat, at least. So... Hmm. Do I risk a deck draw? Hmm. I risk... <laughs> got an evolving black goat because of my totem. What does the black goat evolve into? What would that evolve into? Oh, I am so curious now. I can't really play it in this fight, but... Oh, this isn't great. Yeah, this isn't good. This is extremely not good. I may have to actually sacrifice my stoat. No, it's, yeah. Or the mantis god. And then sacrifice that to bring out the wolf to kill the raven, because that raven is the problem. That raven is a huge problem. I'm gonna do it. That raven is such a problem, I need to get it. I need to get it. Get it. Get it. <laughs> I'm sorry, I know it hit you. I know it's not nice. See, like, if I could just pull... Oh, wait, I could see my hand. Oh, yeah. Because <laughs> I have no cards, I just see the hand. Never mind, that's why. <laughs> black goat? More black goat? What if it becomes, like, white goat? <laughs> It's heavenly goat instead. It's it's like it's it's died so many times. <laughs> Thank you for throwing a thing at me too. Oh, I missed the hydrate imposter check. Oh, was that the reminder? Thank you. I got so invested in the game. <laughs> I fully missed that. Just throw a can at my head and I just don't even realize. <laughs> Thank you. I have a big stretch. I'm gonna sit up straight and I will have a sip of my monster. And I actually think what I might do here, looking at this, I might just draw a squirrel to stick down here to block the porcupine from, like, direct attacking me. I think that should be okay. I hope it will. Like that. <laughs> yep, I, it didn't do any direct damage to me, though. The... the it's still in my favor at the moment. Stoat will probably die. I'm sorry about that. Oh, I can get the alpha. Oh, I, I'm st still gonna die to the raven though. That's so sad. That's so sad. I can I can power stoat for like one turn at least, but that's really sad. Oh well. Yeah, I can't. I can't do anything. It's not looking good. I might die. This is really bad. I I don't know how I can recover from this with the cards I have. I don't know what I can do here. Oh my goodness. Oh wait, unless? Hold on. Do I really want to waste my hook here? No, I don't. I don't want to use the hook here. But the problem is because they're airborne, they're going to attack me directly and I will just die. I'm going to do like the riskiest pull. <gasps> oh, I've got three bones. I need one more. I need one more bone. And then I would be able to use this. Do I? Oh. Maybe. Maybe I do this to buy one more turn. I'm gonna do it. Ah! 
fan, not a fan, not a fan. Well, ow. Okay, I don't need to see anyway. Who needs to see? Who needs to see? Buys me a little bit of time at least. I'll kill that raven, but then there's another one behind it. Oh, and then I think, no, that raven will attack directly. I think, it, let's see, let's see. Just see if I survive. I'm, I'm barely hanging in there. I am like just clinging. See, the problem is I, I don't know how I can get bones. Like, if I draw a squirrel and place it down, can I then just, like, choose to sacrifice it for no reason? I don't think I can. No, I'm lacking the bones, because I... Oh. You know what? Mm. No, it's... Okay, no, wolf should kill that raven. I'm taking two damage. No, that will kill me. That will kill that will kill me. Uh I gotta use the hook if I wanna survive. I I don't want to. But I'm going to I'm gonna hook the raven. That's mine now. I I, I It's like I will just die either way, so I may as well like use my stuff before I die. <laughs> It's like my only, my only thought right now. I'm just like, well, I may as well use it. Use it or lose it. Wait, my squirrel's gonna attack! I just realized, because <laughs> I put it next to the app. <laughs> oh no, the squirrel's actually gonna attack and get hit by the the, the spikes. That's so. Ah. <laughs> uh... Oh, here we go. Okay. Boop 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 boop. Bring it back a little bit, a little bit. Okay. I think I still win. I still win. Your 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 sacrifice was beautiful. Thank you, squirrel. Oh, that actually. Oh, sorry. Sorry, I forgot to draw one. Okay, like this is just mean now at this point. But why not? It's the end of the fight. Boom. Thank you very much. There, that was... That shouldn't have gone that badly. <laughs> but I'm still alive. Believe it or not, you're not the first to lose an eye here. This isn't much fun if you're half blind. Wait, wait, is he gonna give me an eye? <gasps> Perhaps you'd like to replace it? Yes, oh my god, is he gonna give me an eye? Are they gonna be... Oh, they're... <laughs> What is that? What is this one's like? Whoa! I'm gonna I'm gonna go for the woobly one. This eye is interesting. I want I want I want it. Better. I can see again. So yes, thank you. Regardless, the choice is final. Okay, thank you for my new eye. <laughs> Okay. This is not going great. There's an elk. Elk fawn. Quickly grows into an elk. Only, yeah, only one cast and then it grows. Oh, and there's Casey. I'm, I'm not getting Casey. Let's, let's get a little elk. A little elk. Oh, but I don't actually have a big elk. No, let's get the let's get the baby. Oh boy, I'm so close to the fight. That's scary. Wow. Uh. I'm so curious about this and what this means. I feel like I should have made a note of what cards were on it before. 
because I know it was the squirrel and the black goat, but I don't remember which way around they were. I wonder if it's going to be a scenario where, like, if you have all of the specific cards and you have them all in your deck at the same time and play them in the same run, it'll fill out and give you something. I'm going to remember these cards. All right, well, um... Maybe... Sigil? Uh... God, whoa. Wait! Hold on a second, you didn't look like that before. Hello. Nice! I, I, I guess I'm seeing through the eyes of goats now. Nice. Huh. We're also, please don't make comments like that in the future, because that's like um, the kind of thing that's fun for me to spot on my own when I go to play it in-game. I would have spotted that at a different time, but you just all pointed that out now, so... <laughs> so I didn't get that reveal, so please don't, please don't do that! I got the pin message, nobody reads it. <laughs> uh, slight despair, I laugh, but I, it is a, a little bit... Like, that would have been like a really funny moment for me to discover when I draw it from my deck in a match. But it's okay. Right, let's let's go here. Let's do some sigil sacrificing. Hmm. Oh, what do I what do I wanna give to something else? I feel like the mantis god is really cool for like the, the three prong attack, but a little bit weak. So you know what? What happens if we sacrifice a god? sacrifice a god and oh what do I power up in its place wolf three prong wolf oh three prong wolf could be so funny oh yeah I'm doing that three prong wolf triple attack of three that is that is like ridiculous that is so ridiculous <laughs> All right, time for the third boss. I, but I didn't find the film. I didn't find any film. I'm so sad. I don't know how to find the film. I don't know what time I need. Maybe when I die again, I will learn more. You took in the familiar sights and scents of the trapper's pelts, but something was different. The once friendly man now beheld you with a steely gaze. I'm afraid I must be skinning you today. I'd rather you do not. There we go. We got the knives again. There we go. Got the strange frogs. Got the leaping traps. Hmm. <sighs> I need two to sacrifice for the wolf. And I have like no items too. This is so painful. The only thing I can really bring in that does damage is the elk horn. And that's, that is one that moves across, like evolves and moves across. So that would be good to do this lineup, actually. Let's start with that. Let's start with the elk fawn that will go here. It'll only hit it for one, so it won't destroy this one. But then it'll move over to the next side. Oh, and then it might, then it'll die. Never mind, it'll tank a hit. Yeah, no, this is just bad. Oh, I, c I could bring in the amoeba, though. An amoeba does the two-pronged attack. No, I can kill that one, then. Oh, and then that one's not going to move if I, like, trap it in place with an amoeba. Yeah, let's do it. Why not? Why not? 
Oh wait, and then I could just bring in three pronged wolf, but then the wolf is gonna get eaten by like all of the traps. <laughs> oh, going to sleep now. Oh, good night. <laughs> good night, Grace. No, thank you for stopping in. I I hope you have a lovely restful night's sleep. Oh, thank you for the posture check and hydrate before I end too, or before you leave. I'm not ending yet. I've got 20 minutes of a big stretch. And a sip of my monster. At 12.40 a.m. because I'm a smart, sensible person. Yeah, because they all do one damage, which it will kill the elk. No, it won't because the amoeba's gonna kill it. No, we're fine. It's still not great. But it's okay. Yeah, I'm gonna get an elk pelt from this leaping trap, at least. <laughs> uh, not the greatest. This is not very good. What if I literally just bring out loads of squirrels? Just to block the way. Oh, actually... No, yeah, if I place the, the wolf here, it will just die to the traps. If Everything's gonna die to the traps if they attack. Yeah. I don't know what I'm doing. Also, Sarah Cat, oh my goodness, hi! Welcome, welcome, thank you for the raid. Welcome, how's it going? I hope you had fun with the Beat Saber. Welcome in raiders. Welcome to um, Ominous Humming with lots of knives as I prepare to hopefully not be skinned alive, but I probably will be because this is not going well so far. <laughs> but welcome, welcome. I hope you're doing well. I hope you had fun with the Beat Saber. I love that game. Like, uh, when I one day get a VR headset, I'm, I'm going to play so much Beat Saber. I love it. <laughs> I've only ever played it like visiting my friends who have VR. But every time I'm just like, hey, can I, can, can we beat Saber? Can we do some beat Saber for a bit? And then I'm just flailing, flailing around in their living room. <laughs> but oh, one of your favorite games. Oh, this one? Or Beat Saber? Both. <laughs> but welcome in Raiders. Hello to anyone who's new here. Hello, I am Liri. I'm a not so pink haired cat girl from the UK. I usually have pink hair, but I have dyed it for the, the seasonal. <laughs> seasonal festivities of um, spoopy month and I love comfy games and puzzle games and this game has got a lot of puzzling it is very puzzling and it has puzzle elements it is as far from comfy as you can get <laughs> it's so good it's I'm having so much fun with it so far I feel like I'm like missing something but it's okay I'll just keep going until I figure it out but I have been making really good progress I'm I'm, I'm having a blast. I love this game. But yes, oh, yeah, it's, oh, it's so good. I'm so glad I managed to, like, stay not spoiled, like, completely unspoiled for it. Because it's, it's so fun. Right, they're just gonna, like, damage me. They're just gonna damage me. I'll just stick a squirrel down so I don't take the direct damage. But yeah, I think my amoeba's about to die. No, my amoeba's gonna hit the trap. No, the elk will hit the trap first. Oh, this is so sad. Amoeba is just going to die. Thank you for tanking the hit, my good friend. And I got a pelt. Okay, okay. Yep, it's not looking great. It's not going well. And now I have a wolf pelt. You know what? Wolf's gonna get skinned anyways, probably. Let's just go all out with it. Whatever. Get them, get them, and I go... Boop. Like that. Like that. So it is gonna hit that trap next turn. But that's okay because it would get killed by the adder anyway. So I uh, tee hee. Hee hee hee. 
Oh, what are your favorite songs? Oh, it's so perfect. All of the music in this game is just... As soon as it happens, it is so perfectly spot on for the, the situation. Please give me a bone one. Oh, no, okay. I don't have something I can sac- I don't have two things to sacrifice for you. Ugh. Yeah, well, I'll do three direct damage at least. And then get a pelt. And then get hit for one. It, it could be worse. It could definitely be worse. Wait, Wolf didn't die immediately. I thought it would die to the trap. Oh, is it because it was- Oh, it wasn't directly in front of it. Oh, I'm so silly. Because it was like to the side of it at an angle, it didn't like die to the trap. Oh. Oh, I don't know what I can do here. If I do a squirrel, I still can't do anything except place the squirrel and buy a turn. I guess buying a turn is good. Let's do that. Squirrel will die, just buy a turn, but then there won't be an adder immediately there. Now there is, okay. Okay, draw from the deck. You again, hi. Great. Um. Sure. Just to, just a little bit, just to mitigate a little bit of damage. Tiny bit, it's fine. Every little helps. I'm just scared for the wall of bears again. I don't want the wall of bears. Mm. What if I just buy time? So it's like too soon. I wonder if like I have to skin something with each of the traps. And then it will be like the natural end of the, the thing. Let's try it. Fine. Yeah, deal with it. I make the decisions here. I would appreciate a bit of confidence in my decision making. Um, actually, uh, sorry. There may be a wolf coming for you. Uh, my bad. I didn't mean to. Oopsie. Uh, I don't know what the bell thing does. Just bell ringing, represented by the, the, the something and the something something. I don't hear any bells at the moment. So I don't think this will do... Will it do, like, any damage? So maybe I could find out. You're gonna die anyway. What if I replace you with this thing? No, I think I'm gonna tank the Hicks. I don't want to take three direct damage. Alright, squirrel to block the adder. Let's do that. Yep, yeah, not good. Goodbye. Goodbye, my friends. Please give me a bone one. Hey! Oh no. No, I don't want to put you out of here. Oh, I guess you can get the adder. Yeah, Stinkbug can get the adder. Shall we? Yes, that's all I can really do. Oh, I'm gonna take three from this wolf. I don't like that. Ugh. This is not good at all. I've got so many bones. I need to, I think I need to bank on just like drawing a bone thing. I did not, did not. I lost the gamble and I may lose the fight. Yeah, I'm gonna lose. Oh no, I might not completely lose. I'm gonna have one left. I've got one more gamble. One more gamble. <laughs> That's all I got. Please. Oh, wait, no, that can work. That can work, that can work. That can work. Oh, but then if I place the moose bug here, it's gonna shove over stink bug and stink bug will get trapped. Ah. Uh. No, it was sacrifice stink bug for black goat and then bring out the moose bug. I think that's all I can do at the moment. I'm sorry, darkness take you. No, I feel, I feel so bad. 
All right, sacrifice black goat. Moosebuck can take out the wolf. And then move over one and hit, and then move over one and perish to the trap, I guess. Uh -huh. Evolved! Elder Moosebuck! Nice. Huh. Okay, I got a ringworm. Now let's have the turn. Fabulous. Let's get a squirrel. I guess I guess I um skin a ringworm. Skin a ringworm, do I? Yeah, I guess so. I guess so, we, we skin a ringworm, there we go. Great. It's going well. Goodbye, moose. Goodbye, worm. I've got my pelts now. Yep. Okay. Oh, I can stock up. I can stock up. Hold on. How many turns can I do this for? Can I just get all of my cards? Hold on. <laughs> Will he get tired of me after a while? Okay, I can't draw any more squirrels. Do I just draw my whole deck? I don't think I want to actually. I'm gonna stop there. I'm gonna play something now. <laughs> Might not be mad now. Now that, uh, is this long enough? Are you gonna be mad? Am I gonna still get the, the bears? Let's see. Let's uh, get the mantis out, thank you. Right, and then if I put these here, that is enough to win this round. Let's give it a ding. Yep. Okay. Okay. So I feel like I might be in trouble if my whole hand runs out. <laughs> but we will see. I don't know if it's like... Like, there, I know there's some card games where it's like, if you if you end up running out of cards in your deck then and you can't draw at the start of your turn, then you lose. So I, I, I did take all of them, but... Exquisite pelts, but the cycle must continue. But also, my Mantis... Oh, let's trade. Ooh! Powerful cards, I will accept only the finest pelts for them. Okay. Uh, trade for what you can, but know this, the rest will stay and fight for me. Wait, oh my goodness. Oh my, what is this, Grizzly? Okay, I'm, I'm taking that one. I don't want you to have that. Um... I don't want you to have the one that sinks underneath because they're incredibly annoying. And I don't want you to have... That vulture. You would have chosen differently. Well, I'm not you. Okay. That's my last card. All I gotta do is win now. And I think because this is a flying one, then I will just immediately do like seven direct damage and win. But just in case I don't, I'm gonna like play everything else I have. So, yeah. Oh, that, that's enough actually, I think. That's... Yeah, but please, please let me win. There, 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 boom, boom, boom. Yep, one shot. One hit, one shot. Got him. Woo! <laughs> and I got loads of cards. Your lives are restored. Yep. Perhaps one of these will entice you? 
okay? Right, the, the douse. That filthy feral hog, it becomes incensed when its chimes are struck. <gasps> Bell! <gasps> Bell! 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 Oh my god! <gasps> Bell! An amoeba? And child 13. <gasps> Wait, I just realized this is a mushroom! <gasps> oh, I bet this appears when there's something that I already have one of, so I know I can, like, mushroom it with the, the mycologists. <laughs> That's so cool. I remember seeing that before and wondering what it was. It's a mushroom. Anyway, I'm I'm getting the bells because I have the tentacles to go with them. <laughs> but it really was so tense. I'm I'm glad I made it. The mystery of the trapper and trader occupied your thoughts as you wandered onwards. A light in the distance caught your eye. Let me think. Okay, it's this point again. And I still don't have the film reel. I don't have the film reel. I feel like it's gonna be in this clock, but I don't know what time I need. Oh no. Oh no. I don't have it. Oh, well, I'll take those though. Sure, whatever. Right. Hmm. Man, what if I... I didn't get a death card because I won last time. What if I go in, die on purpose, so that I can make myself a cracked death card for the next round and then hopefully figure out what I'm doing then? This feels like a really silly thing, but I, I feel like if I just do the same stuff again, it's just gonna happen again. Hmm. I don't know. Anyway, I want items. I've got no items at the moment. Oh! Hold on. I already took my eye out. Oh, actually, I want to try something. I do want the scissors. Whoa! Oh! Oh no, you can't use that. What is it? What is that? What is that? You say I can't use it, therefore I want to take it. I'm, I'm taking it. Whatever. I don't know what it is. What is that? What is that? That one's only for card dueling. Yep, okay. I'll let you use that, but not now. Oh, I was hoping I might be able to like use the, the pliers to like take this card out of here. But I guess not. I feel like I'd probably need a hammer for that. Or like... Like the pickaxe or something. Hmm. Right, what time is it? It's it's already 1am. I usually end now. But I... I kind of... I kind of want to just like rush in and just see what happens. Like, not overthinking it. Like, take not taking my time like I usually do. I'm just going to go by pure instinct. I'm going to see what my instincts tell me. It's probably not going to help me survive. <laughs> oh, thank you for the hydrate and posture check, too. Have a big stretch. I'm going to sip on my drink. I'm fueled. I'm ready. I'm just going to, like, go for it. It may go badly. It probably will go badly. We'll see. The warm light of the cabin cut through the fog. I cannot fog. think. Surely your tribulations ended here. Surely. Ba, ba, ba. All right. Hello. Hi. Kim. Hello. A rare opportunity arose. Thank you for the gym. The great boons of Leshy's woods were on offer. I, I want to see if the ringworm thing is... <laughs> if I can get the ringworm. <laughs> By having a ringworm. The great boons of Leshy's woods were on offer. The trial of the ring. If you have a ring, you pass automatically. See, this kind of looks like wrapped around. I think I'm right. Trial of skins. I don't think I have my pelts anymore. The trial of the swift. I've got a ring. Let the trial of the ring begin. <laughs> ah, a ring. Oh, it was...
was a random, like, random pull one. Oh, I got so lucky. <gasps> a ring. Success. I do. I have a ring. <gasps> oh, yes. Oh, my God. I'm so glad that worked. <laughs> I knew there was a reason I picked up that silly worm. I just can't resist the worms. Your choice of boons. The boon of the Bone Lord. You will start a battle with eight bones. <gasps> oh, and then the ambidextrous. Boon of the forest, you will start a battle with grand furs on all of your spaces. That's actually really cool. Unless they get a bunch of flying enemies. No, the, the flying enemies still wouldn't get past. That's pretty cool. That's like just like warm up time. That's just like time before each battle to start. I do like the draw two cards though. Let's do it. Once again. Uh, the Trial of Rarity must include a rare card. Trial of the Winged must have an airborne card. Trial of the Finned must have a waterborne spell. Well, like, I don't have many airborne and waterborne. I'm gonna risk it on the rare. Wait, do I have the rare? No, I sacrificed the, the Mantis King. Do I even have a rare card? Oh no, I have the, the, long, the long Elk. I'm just gonna try. I'm gonna see if I can just pull the long elk first try. Let the trial of rarity begin. I got the long elk. Yes! Hee <laughs> hee hee I get two boons. Oh my goodness. Yes. The boon of goat's blood. You'll start with a black goat on the board. Like that. Boon of the forest. That's the furs. Boon of the magpies. Oh. I'm getting this one. I'm going on instinct. I'm going on what feels right. Hi. You managed to get both of my boons. I rarely say this, but I'm impressed. You've been a worthy adversary. But unfortunately, I must soon put you to death. That's nice. Okay, let's do it. Come get me. Just gonna be super reckless. Hi. You're back. Sit. Not a dog. Okay. <laughs> well, looks like I'll have to beat him again. <laughs> Shut up, dude. This isn't a. This is one of your card unpacking videos. Oh, how I relish this moment. Yep. Give me my smoke. Thank you. Two flames will not suffice this time. We got three. And there's the moon being like clunked into place. I start with a bone. I can draw two cards. Yep. I've got scissors. I've got pliers. I've got this. Uh, nothing will happen. This bottle of goo has no use. Really? Really, really? Interesting. Right, how do I start this? I think I start this by... Sticking this here. Just to block this for a turn. Because Mole Man can't attack, it's fine. There, that's my first turn. The real fun is happening in the next turn. Where I'm gonna start drawing whichever cards I want to. Because you know what I'm thinking would be really good right now? I'm thinking it would be so good to have... The three-pronged wolf. <laughs> Prong wolf and another squirrel. Squirrel goes here. Eight. Squirrel goes here. Let's sacrifice both of those. Get the wolf here and hit for a bunch immediately. See how it goes. Hello, Chaotic Shorty! Welcome! 
<laughs> three-pronged wolf, successor to three-wolf moon. <laughs> I like my three-pronged wolf. I feel like it's good. Oh, thank you so much for the follow too, Chaotic Shorty. Welcome. Welcome on in. Welcome to, um, I'm probably going to bed soon, but I felt like being reckless before I did. So here I am. Yeah, let's go for it. Boom, boom. <laughs> Pretty nice. Oh, there. Goodbye. 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 I should have noticed he had the pickaxe out. It's it's okay. It's okay because I can still pick whatever card I want, and that's gonna be. Something I can just win with, I think. Black oat. And a squirrel! So what I'll do is I'll put the squirrel down, sacrifice that for the black goat, and then use that to bring out the moose buck, which I'm not actually going to attack the enemy with. I'm just going to attack directly so I can win this, um, this first section. I'll put you there. Attack. Nice. And I've got so many bones now from the the gold nuggets. <laughs> the moon-soaked forest bed gave rise to shadowy figures. Gasping for air, uh, gasping for night air after their long and torturous slumber. There, it's it's Kaminsky and Lewis again. Ah yes, I remember that one. Oh, I should have saved the hook for now so I could get myself back. Because he's probably going to play me. And I'm going to be mad. I should have saved the hook for it. I'm... Ah. Uh, ah. Uh. It's okay. Uh, I need... I've got a lot of bones. Let's, let's get something I can... Use bones for. <gasps> Amoeba! Amoeba has, like, random... Surprise. I could do with that gold nugget being destroyed. If any of the enemies wanted to do that, that would be really cool. But, uh... Hmm. Right, because what I want to do is I want to play this one, the, the douse that has bells, alongside this one, which has the little bell thing, because I think... When that happens, like, if I have bells on the board, that will boost this. I think that's what that will do. But yeah, yeah, it, it was use the hook or die. Like, the, the only reason I used it was because it would just be the end, end of the run if I did that. So I figured I may as well see how far I can go. I didn't expect to make it all the way here again. But it's okay. Hmm... Oh, well, I guess my long out can just kill that in one hit. Yeah, so let's get the long elk. Yep. Oh, and I have to draw another one. Okay. What else do I want to draw? I don't care too much about these, to be honest. I'm, mm. Let's just get a squirrel. Squirrel for now. And then long elk goes here. You will just kill that. Thank you very much. Oh, and that's going to kill... K K uh, Kaminsky as well behind the tree stump because of four attack. So that's fine, and then that'll push all of these over one. Let's see how this goes. Boop. Boop. The might of the moose cannot be halted. Hmm, stale fish, hard choose. Nope. Don't. You don't want that. There I am, yep. There I am. Still got me. It's still got my card. I want it. <laughs> I want my card back. I wish I hadn't taken the hook. Uh, it's okay next time. When I inevitably die next. Uh. Let's take Alpha. And it is a squirrel, I guess. Because I can then buff the moose again. 
fish, easy choose. It's okay if you take that. I don't mind. Because I'm just going to win this round. And then you will put your hook away, I think. There we go! <laughs> Kagu, hello! Inscription, yes! This is my first time playing it and I'm having such a blast. Hello! It's ought to work again. Okay, yeah, get the moon. I've got a pair of scissors. <laughs> oh yes, it still works just fine. Oh, okay, I've, I've got to draw cards. It's forcing me to draw cards before I can just take it. It's okay. Please, I just, I'm just gonna cut it up. Oh, there are no cards of mine that you can cut. I can't cut the moon up! Devastating. Right, let's see what this does. I am serious, you cannot use that. There's no possible use for it. I'll place it on that shelf over there for now. Oh! My advice, avoid it. Okay, I've, I've put goo on the shelf. I wish I could go back and check the shelf now. I wanna, I wanna see it on the shelf. Uh, anyway, um, oops, I guess. Let's just see how it goes. Attack the moon. Oh yeah, I forgot that. I've got the... <laughs> I did it again! <laughs> I did it again! I got the poison thing on the, the long elk. I forgot about that again. Oh, I'm so glad. I'm not the first to triumph over the moon. I know, I already did it. But go on. Finish it. Yeah, okay. Okay, let's, um, goodbye. I won again. I didn't even mean to. I was, I was going to lose, but I won again. <laughs> nice. I, I always need to just go for the poison every time. Like that, that sigil is, I think, my favorite. Out of all the ones I've seen so far, the poison one, like that one has saved me so many times. You had won the respect of the strange cabin's inhabitant. Your body quaked as the adrenaline of the battle subsided, leaving you with a gnawing hunger you had not eaten for days. Is it not so? Woo! No. <laughs> not again. Surely this food will please you. No. Took extra care in preparing it. I don't want it. Really? This does not meet your standards? Very well. That's probably the person before me. Like, I don't want to eat that. <laughs> Stand there. All right, take a photo. I didn't find any film. We're fine. Eh. I guess it's time for number two. Go on. Go on. I know, there's no film. Yes. I, I clicked it too many times. It's sort of like, yes, this is your... This is my camera. And no, it does not function without a loaded film roll. Go. You are a champion and I wish to memorialize you. Thank you. It's great. Please inscribe your name. What if I do a different name this time? Tell you what, this can be Jim. Jim won that, that time. Be still now. You won. Jim. Jim. Jim! Good job, Jim. You did it. Perfect. Okay. Another challenger approaches. Wow. Your predecessor defied the odds and defeated me. It is unlikely to happen again. Your starting deck. That's fine. Whoa, they're changing again. Whoa, Stoat is like super oblong now. What is... Whoa. Whoa, okay. Okay, all right. All right, where is that goo? Where's the goo? Oh, wait, let's let's see what Jim looks like. Oh, Jim's cool. Look at that. Hi, Jim. Jim. Nice. Boop, and I want to see what the goo does. Whoa, hi. 
Ah! Your pain is unbearable. Even after all these years. What do you want? I have very little to live for these days. Can I let you out? Ah! I watched that dagger do its work. For a moment, I felt that my misery had company. Oh, but it had its own noble purpose. Surely a step towards freeing the master. The master? Ah! Watching the angler lose. Now that soothed my pain. An old rival of mine, that fisherman. He bested me this time, but I will have another chance. Can I not let you out of here? I witnessed the final defeat of Leshy over there. Quite a spectacle. Though I had no hope that it would bring me freedom. For that to happen, I think you would need something special up your sleeve. Like a, a film of... camera... film? Ah. Okay, that's, that's all you're saying. Right. Now we've got a magpie. Wait, I've not seen a magpie. Oh, wait, you're, oh, you're narrating stuff now. You're wondering about that painting? I've seen stuff come out of it. Mm. But only if the cards are aligned just right. Oh. Oh, my goodness. This goo's going to tell me about things. So I bet if I go examine the clock, the goo's going to help me. Ooh. I don't know if I want that. A little hint goo. I guess at this point, with how much I've done, it's probably fair enough to, to have a bit of hint goo. <laughs> but yeah, I think with that, that's a, a good spot to leave it at until next time. So, yep, last save two minutes ago. Yeah, it's going to be just like the start of the cabin. So I'll have to talk to the goo again, but that's fine. I can start next time with that. And with that, I think that is about time for me to go to bed. So I shall, bloop. I'll head on over to here and we can find a raid target. Oh my goodness, I love this game. This game is so wild. I, I've got a theory. I've got a theory that like, there's gonna be something with the eyes. Like depending on which eye I pick, maybe things will change. Like I'll, I'll see things differently, like the goat. <laughs> So that's going to be like my, my, the thing I'm going to aim towards when I start next week. I'm, I'm going to like, I'm going to immediately take out my eye. Yeah. <laughs> but oh, it's so interesting though. It is so cool. I am so excited to, to delve deeper. I want to see how far it goes. But oh my goodness, it's so good. It's so good. Oh, good game. But yes, it is now um, quarter past one in the morning. And I should probably try and get some sleep. So let's see who's on to send a raid to. Who we got? Who's around? Oh, there's so many people I know online. Ooh. Oh, I'm so bad at making decisions. You know what? Because, uh, because Momo is doing the partner push at the moment, I think I want to send you to Momo. Oh, she's, she's playing Resident Evil 2. Uh, Resident Evil 1. 2 as well. <laughs> I meant 2 as in, like, also. And then I realized that's actually a number. Uh, but yeah, uh, Momo's playing Resident Evil. The the original. The, the first version of it. The first game. And I'm going to send you over her way. Because she's currently doing a partner push to try and reach partner on Twitch. And I think she's going to do it. She's great. She deserves it. So gonna head gonna head over that way and support her and i'm like forgetting how to exist now like my brain is just empty <laughs> i used it all up i got no brain left yippee over to momo here is the raid message i say as i get clonked in the head thank you for the hydrate if you're subbed we've got the leery fire if not there's the the regular fire i have a sip of my drink and I will send you over to the lovely Momo. I am so excited to play this again next week. I'm, I'm, I'm so excited. I love it. This is great. I'm still so proud of like surviving the wall of bears. Like that is like, I'm, I'm so proud. I'm this truly like one of my proudest moments. I could have given up, but I am incredibly stubborn and persistent. I didn't want to give up. 
And I'm so glad. I'm so glad it was so good. I, I feel powerful. I love it. I feel like I've had so many moments of that in this game too, where I've like actually come up with something fairly clever and it's worked and I've just felt like a genius. It's really good for that kind of like puzzle satisfaction. I'm, I'm, I can't wait to play more. But yes, um, I'm gonna go to bed now though, because I'm, I'm very tired. And I, I, I did get some sleep today, but I didn't get to sleep until like 9 a.m. in the morning. So I'm, I'm tired now. I'm going to bed. Oh, it was so fun though. I can't wait. I can't wait to play it again next week. But yes, thank you so much everyone for joining me today. And until next time, bye-bye.